What's up, everybody? Welcome back to more Neo. The world ends with you. I have no idea where we left off. We've been playing Yu-Gi-Oh! this entire time. And um, now we're going back to Neo. <laughs> uh, um, actually, go to thoughts. Mental notes. Today's objective. Tower Records needs help and Shibuya Hikuri. Okay, let's go to Tower Records and such. And Cat Street. Whatever. Q2 Wieners. You guys can't say that. Hey, Kiria. Mr. Lollipop. Lollipop, lollipop, lolly, lolly, lollipop. Hmm. Are these any fun to fight? I can't wait to Already did. This. Let's do it to it, yo. Whoa. These are new. Holy shit, they hurt as well. Follow me, yo! Nice one! Already gonna show us the rap. Didn't I already show it? Sure felt like I did. Show to the YouTube froggy weenies. Okay, look. This is the rap. Flattened. And everything crushed. I think I'm just gonna use it here. These guys are pretty tough. Crushed like my hopes and dreams. <laughs> I was about to say which hopes and dreams still are, but <laughs> felt a little bit too. Uh... Nice one, nah, girl. Oh, 
Oh my god, you already <laughs> say that. <laughs> you already make me cry. Why, Lizzie? He didn't show us. I did show you the rap. I've literally held it here. All crushed. Everything. <clears throat> What the fuck do you mean I didn't show you the rap? <sighs> not cool, Lizzie, not cool. <sighs> Saying I didn't show you the rap. I obviously did. Q. Whoa. Yo. Cardia is possessed. The wicked twisters. Something's amiss. He get over there, lollipop. I don't think he is. It's the noise that got him. Yo, Penny. Yes. Do the thing, yo. If we don't save him, we need you to dive in there. Come on, you got this. Didn't expect that. You sure got me good. Didn't think he'd come after me like that. Should've known better. It was only a matter of time after that stunt I pulled. Who's he talking about? Yordi is Neo. Yordi is Yordi. I got you good, Shiba. <laughs> Shouldn't have made him. But who'd have thought he had that in him? Wicked Twisters might still stand a chance. I just hope Azuki doesn't bite off more than she can chew. Rindo, the noise! At least we're not on a timer, that's good. Surprised they got even more colors. Heads up. Ain't no stopping us now. Let's turn up the volume, yo. To do it. No doubt about it, that's Shibuya Syndrome. You carry a goddamn. His internal voice also made reference to someone else. Who do you suppose it is? It might be. Karia, what did you do to him, you little rats? Wasn't us, yo. We just got rid of the noise that was messing with his head. Noise? Kubo, that bastard, Gramps. The Reapers are supposed to work together and not attack each other. Why would he do that? 
Do something like that. It's infuriating. Even like the very bottom rung of the ladder. How could you let a wimp like that do this to you, Zuki? Put yourself together already. Hmm. What? No. I just want to help him remember who he is. And exactly fix him. It's a good place to start. He's telling the truth. Let him do it. Huh? Hmm? How long was I out? Karia, talk to me! What the hell happened? I can hardly move. You got taken over by the noise. Oh yeah. We really messed that one up, didn't I? How to watch out for Kubo. Guy's a lot tougher than he lets on. What good is giving advice to the player is going to do? A lot more good than pretending our titles matter anymore. Is that supposed to mean? I mean, you gotta loosen up, girl. Bend the rules a bit, or else your booyah is gonna disappear. Maybe that wouldn't be much of a loss. Excuse me? This place has gotten pretty dull lately, don't you think? Shibuya is gonna go up in flames soon, all thanks to us Reapers. The noise are messing things up in the RG too. All those people, all their lives clashing and melding and drifting apart, that's what made Shibuya so vibrant. That Shibuya, our Shibuya, is already long gone. I managed to keep the noise in the RG under control for a bit. But it looks like I won't be much help anymore. Man, I didn't even last a whole day. So what you get is for stirring up trouble. Guess so. Now you've got to keep stirring if you want to survive, Kalia. Could you two hurry it up? We ain't got time for this. And a pinky, if you with them, the Shinjuku Reapers. I'm gonna take you out right here now. G is well oiled and perfectly managed machine. Conductor, the mas game master's orders are absolute. You know better than anyone. We both do. Are you seriously still sticking to those precious rules of yours? Even though that's basically how you lost Shibuya in the first place? Well, it's ridiculous. More important things to be doing anyway. There she goes. You really struck a nerve, little lady. Did I lie? This is fought for Shibuya too, you know, in her own way. Back then we couldn't make up our minds on how to handle the Shinjuku gang. Gang, 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 gang. If we let them have their way, it's only a matter of time before they destroy the city. We really don't want to get on their bad side. If we don't do as they say, there's no telling what they'll do to us. So why not give them what they want? Or at least pretend to. Make them think we're giving in so they let their guard down. That's insane. There's no way they'll let us take Shibuya back once it's theirs. Well, if you got a better idea, I'm all ears. So what, we're just supposed to hand over our city on a silver platter? Enough. We can't keep bickering like this. Make a decision already. What do we do? Sorry, didn't know. Meh. No way you could've. Just like we had no way of knowing what your deal is. Hey, Mr. Mask. Uh, yeah? I don't think I can make it back to the RG for a while. Try to wrap things up here before they get much worse out there, huh? Yeah. Well, and lit, don't you worry. Look at you, kid, all grown up and dependable like. That you've got your big point pants on, you can start looking for Kubo around Tipsy Toes Hall. Just be careful. So Kubo's on the prowl today. Do we want to go after him? If our aim is to learn more about the Shinjuku Reapers, he seems an acceptable place to start. Yeah, what Pity said. We can start. We can ask him about all the stuff we know and want to know. Okay, let's go for it. Okay, let's have a look. Streets. I need to go to Tower Records because there's a quest there. And to Shibuya Hikari. Then to Tipsy Toes Hall, I guess. Hey, isn't it MKN? MK who? You know, the girl who does all the graffiti. We spent forever tracking her down that one, one time. Oh yeah, almost forgot about that. She can't be here to paint, no walls on the corner, so what's she up to? Bet we can find out if we scan her. Let's have a look. 
tried contacting the building staff, but I can't get through. Oh, I hope it doesn't fall and break. What should I do? You know, I left a memento grandma gave me on top of that building. I was so happy to be painting. Must have forgotten. Seriously? She left something that important all the way up there. How did she even get there in the first place? Well, well, what? You like helping people, right? Are we doing this or what? I mean, yeah, I want to, but do we really have time? Doesn't matter. We can't just leave her like this. So let's help. Guess you're right. Hell yeah! Do hey, your thing, kitty girl. How you doing? Get ready. Hey, Bobo. Is this it? Mm -hmm. The graffiti's definitely hers, at least. Girl must really love her grandma to be carrying around something to remember her by her everywhere. Gotta do. I mean, nothing without family. Is this really a memento from her grandma? We got what we came for. Let's go. Let's have a look. Let's go. Could be worse. Could be worse. How are you, Bobo? Spray can gamma grave grandma gave me. What's it doing here? Huh? Did it fall from up there? Thank goodness I got it back. My art's just isn't the same without it. Huh. This kind of makes me want to pay her a visit. Heck, her store is not too far from here. Maybe I'll say hi. If I'm lucky she might give me another memento from her younger days. I wonder what it'll be this time. Wait, her grandma's still alive? The living normally give out mementos? Why not? Carpe the DM and all that. In any case, her troubles are no more. Shall we get back to the mission? Yeah, we still got time. What does she give us? Is it worth? Plentiful pins. Boost your pin drop rate when you lower your level. Eh, not for now at least. It was slow today, so I had time to work on my Cthulhu one-shot. Nice. I decided that today we're not going to waste as much time on random battles as that I usually do. Today we're going to make some speed. <laughs> Just this bug, yeah. You know what? We're not gonna eat here. Never mind. Got a new crisps, but they are for the weekend when my friend comes over. Nice though. Welcome. there. It was on Hickory, right? They be on a higher floor. Let's go. Let's move. 
Oh shit. It's the girl. Boss? This is that apparition. Appro wait. She left us that dying message or letter, right? Kinda of amazing that thing still exists. Wait, what do you mean, thing? What even is it? Honestly, calling it an apparition feels a bit off. It's it's cognitive energy that drifted over from Shinjuku. Didn't that place get totally wiped out? The city did, but it looks like some of the strongest refused to give up the ghost. Hey Nagi, do you think you could handle this? I know not if I can offer much help against this specter of sorts, but I shall give it my best effort. Riko Seiki no Hara. It's cold, so cold. Where am I? My favorite park. The government building. Oh, gone. Okay, I'm not gonna care about the time right now. I'm just gonna care about be Nani. Wonder if this is actually multiple waves or not. Because I'm starting to have a feeling like they may not. This one might actually be very hard. Well, I'm already dead, never mind. We'll never join that Discord. Never, you are already in that Discord. But how will you know if they're good enough for your for guests? Taste test. Hey, if he doesn't think they are good, then that means more for me. I don't see the problem. Of course. Of course. That means we don't have to share. <laughs> or at least you don't have to share. Okay, I need to go after the jellyfish ASAP. Nice, we can go boomers. Just need to win. It's an honor to be recognized. 
I feel honored to be recognized. Zip zap beam. Got 22 points right now. You need to change pins. No, I don't need to change pins. Fuck you, I knew it. It's time for me to move on. Goodbye. Gotta go be with my mom. It was formidable phantasm indeed. You okay? Yeah, it's nothing. Let's get going. All right. Snare Trap E sees only the target to stop their movement for a long time. Engraved with the words, a true friend shares your dreams. Mm. What to do? Okay, see what she gives. Increases the amount of money earned when selling pins. Nice. Money, money, money. Let's go find Kubo. Center Street. Those poor guys that are consumed by the noise. The poor people. Tipsy Toes Hall. Maybe Kubo's around here. Where though? R right there. Seriously? <laughs> wow. That's trap. And there he goes. After him. Wait, he could be trying to get away, or he could be leading us into a trap, stealing your toes. Got it. He fled that away just past the police station. Must be heading for Udagawa. And that's where we're going, yo. <sighs> hey, hey, dude. Let us through. Are you gonna give us a mission or not? Defeat this. Yo, we can't understand the word you're saying. You'll catch any of that? Alas. How are we supposed to complete the mission if we don't know what it is? We defeat... Well, it's clear enough. Defeat the noise in this area. Defeat certain... Hmm. You're too late. Shibuya is as good as destroyed. Huh? What? Ishima. If only you had arrived earlier. You could have completed the mission and passed through the wall. You knew the noise are gathering in Miyashita Park, and that halting their m multiplication would allow you to pass, mm. did you not? Explanation we received, and therefore our understanding of the situation was incomplete. This mission was the key to stopping the explosive spread of Shibuya Syndrome, and of course the, to allow you to advance beyond this wall. Oh, very tragic that you missed such a crucial opportunity. If only things had gone differently. Wait, Shibuya Syndrome is going to Spread explosively? Inevitably, at this point, though, it matters not to us, Juku Reapers. Uh... Is this are you going to give us a mission? If we go to Shibuya uh, Miyashita Park and take care of the noise, let us through? Not quite, but the end result would be much the same. Make of it what you will. Yo, can we trust that this brother? I'm not sure. He never takes anything seriously, so it's hard to judge. Mm. Looks serious enough to me. Well, standing here thinking about it won't get us anywhere. Yeah. Might as well go to Miyashita Park. Sure, can't hurt. That's something we gotta remember, most likely. Because seeing of the visions from last stream, when we entered this, we're most likely going to time travel. Because we're gonna get... Uh, Booby trapped. And I also have a feeling that we're gonna run into Miyamimoto. While he's engulfed by the plague noise. Mm. 
that's just my feelings. It's a Miyashita Park. But where are all the noise? There should be enough that they'll be easy to spawn. No. Never fear, fight, fight for your fear instead. Huh? Isn't that... Something Mo Moto used to say. It was probably just words to him, but... Always oh. sounded cool to me. It's still hard to believe Motoi was really, you know, like that. Hell, he probably stole that quote from someone. Coming out, my hero is a fraud. I was really broken up about that before. But now, I'm glad I know the truth. Are you? Yeah, I feel like things make more sense now. Before, I would just kind of parrot the stuff he'd said. But now I actually think about what it all means. Hmm, nice yeah. for you. This time, I'm not rattling off some random quote. Not just warts anymore. Beef with gravy, veggies, and ravioli. Has to mean something. Well, as long as it means something to you, that's what matters. Yeah, now let's fight if our fear and the noise. Let's have a look. Gotta focus. Well, this park's actually kind of big. Didn't realize that. As we seek, unless there is another ginormous swarm we missed, better finish them off quickly. Okay. I can do this. I foresee no difficulties. this actually hit? These guys just keep spinning. They spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record, baby, right round, right round. Can't really get close to them like this. Things are weak against fire, and good to know. No piggy? I call them warping machines. I don't know, I've not been paying attention for piggies. Born of the stormy skies, a Rajin surge. They won't stop coming. Damn. Even making a dent? No, but I really hope the answer is yes. I think I'm just gonna blast them. Oh, fuck. I got damaged. And there goes my 300. Super dumb. At least I'm glad that these don't, like... Multiply. Yeah. <laughs> 
This is part. This part. Yeah, this sucked. Why, Sush? Why did this suck? I'm not having that much issues with them, other than the fact that they're being washing machines. I just hate plague noise. Yeah, plague noise are fairly annoying. How is he not exhausted? It's this perplexing, but also encouraging to see him fight so spiritedly. That's one way to look at it. He's not wrong, though. Just a little more team, we can do this. I relied on my 300% so much because I always leveled different pins. Oh yeah, that's all. I'm doing the same thing, right? But... And here's the big but. I realized that using purely different pins the entire time is just gonna wreck everything on you, and I don't like that. It just doesn't feel nice, and it doesn't... So instead I'm like leveling two or three different ones and then, you know, the others are basic so that I know what moves I can use easily. Some lady called, she said she was being attacked by a witch, go away. How are you doing, Sush? Hey. By the way... Can the Rona stop already? I'm sick and tired of it. And I only have it. I've only been having it for like. What day is it today? Since Sunday. Yeah, mission complete. Yo, geez, that took forever. Let's get back. Step on it. We got an old man to grill. Yeah, gotta get Kubo to tell us what's going on. Mission completed. Hi Hiroshima should be willing to allow us pass. Aspect of truth. I got Chinese. See ya. Yo, take vitamin D for COVID is great. Eat vitamin Ds. He already said he was making us raps. I wasn't making anyone raps. Enjoy your Chinese sep. Oh, okay, these two are done. What is this? Poison. Guardian Glaives. This looks kind of nice. Guess we'll put this one on L2. Could throw another triangle on or an R1, L1. I think I'm gonna look for an R1 or L1 to level up. Way too many things. What is this? Charge. Uh, this one seems nice. Doesn't seem like a bad one. Oh, there's Froggy here, or a Picky, whatever. 
Biggie. I blasted my system with fantasy. Promised me and Zillow wraps. Only if you guys were coming over. To which I also said that it's best not to be done. So, I technically just negated it all. Plane tickets. Lizzie, don't lie. Zero doesn't have enough money for plane tickets. Oh, these guys can also fuse back together? Oh, shit. Need more AoE. Nailed it. Barely, but nailed it. Where are we going? Chinese wraps, but no one invited me, sad. Also, I don't want to fly anymore. Nothing to worry about, uh, Bobo. Lizzie just said that I promised her wraps, but I said only if she came over, and same to Zillar. With the quotation on it, but you guys better not come because, you know, COVID. And yet they still want to come over, dumbasses. Going in already had COVID. <clears throat> no, we're, you're not okay, Lizzie. That's not how this works. It's not cool. <laughs> Why do I have my hentai page open? Oh, I need to go to the toilet. Unbelievable. I just ate dinner and now I already need to take a poop. Beer be guys.
chocolate ice cream. I have natural antibodies. Yeah, that's what I said as well. Then suddenly I got COVID. That was a small poop. Yeah, very small. <clears throat> I could tell you guys exactly how it goes with me, but uh, that's TMI. Sure, so you have eliminated the source of the multiplying noise. Yeah, well, that is true. As much as I would like to, it's not my right to do so. It is this fellow's something. Something must be done about him if he wished to pass. Are you crying? It's affected a very different number of us. So you're telling us to get rid of the noise in this guy. He go back to normal if we do. He might. He might not. I cannot say. Means there are only one way to find out, and we gotta get right up in there. Jealous. You've got a lot of nerve taking me on, yo. Don't make me laugh. Holy shit, I'm taking a shit ton of damage. Especially these walls are fucking garbage. Well, got nothing better to do. Okay, just blow them up. Just do what Sushi did. Get the 300 and start blowing the shit up. At least two of them are out. I mean, is anyone surprised? Not too shabby. You did it. Yet the affliction remains, and Hishima is nowhere to be seen. You did this part too. Yo, check it out, Wall's gone. Oh, hey, you're right. Somewhere. Oh, I doubt this Reaper is the one who dropped it. I see. Which leaves Sir Hishima. Perhaps he had the right uh... after all. He just wanted us to help the guy out. He is quite pragmatic. The he is quite pragmatic, it seems. Honestly, who knows what that guy is thinking? Well, at least we can go through now. Let's track down Kubo. Wonder if I should spend some of my points. What do I even get from you? Another deck. I got twenty-one points at the moment. Uber pin, multi pin wheels, uber pin. The 
Pigdar. Ground curry. Glutton for glutton. I'm just gonna spend a few, I don't really care at this point anymore. HP retainer. This one. Secret report number four. And you. That's it. The Uber Pins. Yes. Uber. Gotta focus. Hey there. What's Thanks. up? Come back soon. Hey there. What's up? How's it going? Wow, they got a lot of new shit. Monochrome jacket. Dark matter. Looks good though. Trades. No turning back. Assassin Strike. See you later then. See you later then. Let's move. Kubo piece of trash. This is booby trap time. Got gotcha you now, old man. Who you think you call an old, huh? I knew you'd show your ugly mugs around here sooner or later. Hope you're ready for party Shiba's throwing for you. It's gotta be a real banger. <laughs> I am loath to imagine what sort of soiree this might be. Doesn't sound like it really it's, it's really my scene. Aw, oh, you could at least try and enjoy yourself. After all, we're rolling out the red carpets for you. <laughs> What the hell's going on, yo? Huh? They're all infected. They're coming after us like zombies or something. We gotta take them all down. I doubt I can manage to dive each of their minds individually. Who was controlling all these noise? You see now? I'm on a whole nother level from you, chumps. <laughs> <laughs> Rin dude, now might be a good time to do time travel thing. We can't take this. Here they come. Heavens help us. Let's get this party started. Yep, and that's the mistake. What do I do now? Maybe there's a way to stop so many noise from showing up. Cat Street. We don't stand a chance against that many noise. If only we could stop some appearing from appearing. Back at Cat Street, this is when we found Keria, took care of his noise inside of him. You can start looking for Kubo around Tipsy Toes Hall, just be careful. So Kubo's on the prowl today, do we want to go after him? If our aim is to learn more about Shinjuku Reapers, he seems an acceptable place to start. Yeah, what Pinny said, we can ask him about that stuff we want to know. Hold on a minute. I've already done this once before. After this, Kubo heads to Udagawa and he uses everyone infected with Shibuya Syndrome to attack us. And the noise causing the infection are coming from Miyashita Spark. We should go there first and stop them from multiplying. They're multiplying? Yeah. But if we stop them, they won't infect as many people. And that's how that make our job a whole lot easier. So we have to take out a bunch of noise before going to Kubo. If it lessens the burden we must bear later, I think that would be a wise decision, so Miyashita Park. Yeah, the noise at the park comes first. We'll change our fate. NOISE! <sighs> nope, maybe later. Hopefully coming directly to Miyashita Park. Change the future. Well, 
We are able to hold our own well enough last time. But no matter how many noise we took out, it wasn't enough. They just kept multiplying. I think we might have missed the one that's spawning the rest. So there's some kind of bulls noise, huh? Then I say we aim for that one, yo. That would be a wise sound strategy. We'll have to find it first. Let's have a look. Hey, does that noise look like you unusually large to you? Maybe, I guess it does look a little bullsish. So is it go time or what? Don't know. Doesn't look all that bag big to me. Hmm, you might be right. You know, best dog. He give the word we strike. We get it wrong, no biggie. Guess that's fair. But which one is it? We fought a lot of them here last time. That's the one for sure. There, that one. That's our target, all right. Just look at it. I don't found it. Good going. Now leave the noise busting to me. Just turn up the volume, yo! Oops, wrong, 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 wrong. You're, you're doing it wrong! Okay, let's go in. Just blast him. Spaghetti! Can I be your friend, come over and have spaghetti and crisps? Poor SQ won spaghetti and crisps. I'm 
Boom. Spaghetti and crisps. Ah, owned. A veritable success, that's all of them. There were definitely fewer noise this time. Got a good feeling about this. Hooray, go us, celebration. So, time to tipsy halls. Or wait, Udagawa. Let's go get Kubo. Kubo! Yeah, if only that was everything, right? I thought we were already friends. That's cute, you disappointed, Bubbo. Hey, punk. Gotcha now, old man. Who do you think you call an old, yeah? Then you'd show your ugly mugs around here sooner or later. Hope you're ready for a party she was throwing you. It's gonna be a real banger, <laughs> Although, gotta say, it ain't quite as lively as I'd hoped it'd be. You did something, didn't you, Mr. Rindo Kanade? Think that earns you visit from our very special guest. He's just dying to meet you. <sighs> Lollipop already taken over again. Let me just reintroduce some noise into the system and then... Damn it. Gotta take down Lollipop, this ain't good, yo. Oh, you have no idea. I swear I have to do everything myself. Whoa. It's a pinky! It is! Katia, pull yourself together. Just how long do you plan on slacking off? And just leave me to handle the RGL by myself? Well, ain't that a bummer? I mean, I knew the guy was powerful and all, but I didn't think he'd be able to shake the noise and come to sense so easy. That's put me in a bit of bind. Ah, well. Uzuki Yashiro, Koki Kadia. I'm gonna have to mark both of you down as traitors to the Reapers, traitors. Ha! <laughs> and loyalty has always been to my city, not to a scumbag like you. Whatever you say, sweetie. Out of way. You're about to see what I'm really made of. Witness the true power of the Noise Master! What the hell? Uzuki, the RG's in trouble, we've gotta get to the border. Mask, Skull, think you can handle this guy, can we? We gotta. Can't do nothing about the RG, so ain't that like we can trade places? Leave Grems to us, thanks kid. I'll take care of the RG. Just how do you plan on taking care of it? With your help, of course. What? I mean, I guess. It's you, me, girl? Lucky I got such a great boss. One who cares so much about her city and her subordinates. Makes me feel like I can take on the world. Alright, ready. Later. Let's get a move on before I change my mind. You're counting on you. Don't let us down. Whatever, I'm not doing it for you. Let's leave the RG to those two. So we can focus on what we gotta do here. You punks in for a surprise if you think I'm going down easy. I ain't like the flunkies you've fought before. We can take whatever you throw at us, Gramps. Come on, let's go. Time to fight Gramps. Finally, we can beat Kubo's ass. Oh, or not. Oh, crap. Dogs are pissing me off. Okay, where's the other fucking donk? There.
Ugh, oh, freak. What's up, SQ? Uh, I think I need to change... The triangles and the squares. I can't use charges in here. Too much going on. And the shield is absolute trash. just cancelled my entire pin. Man looks sai. Okay, that's the wolves down. Midnight snack, but it's not midnight yet. Damn, it wasn't for the shit amount of healing that I can do with uh, threats and Shoka. Same thing. Like three and a half hours. <clears throat> This ain't gonna fly, huh? <laughs> ain't no way my noise could lose to a bunch of schnots like you! Guess we're just on a whole nother level from you. Watch your mouth, wise ass. Hey, you still looking for a fight or something, Gramps? Because we'd be happy to beat you again. Why, you little... What the... Time to take out the trash, Minami Moto. Mr. Minami, you came back, my lord. Great. What? Hold up. The hell's Pie Face doing here, yo? Wait, you know him? Yeah, he's a Reaper. I think he's a Reaper. Was a Reaper, but he's not anymore. Doesn't mean he's any less powerful, though. Mm, I can't remember. Come on, think. Hey, I remember such clarity. Tabuti over there made a mess uh, this whole city back in the day. He's one tough brother. Tabuti? 
He's like a living legend. What the hell you come back for, yo? Curious. That's all. So ka Toa? What? Look at that smug face of his. Are you gonna help us out again? Help us? You out of your damn mind? I mean, he was on our team before you showed up. He saved our ass tons of times. No way! Yeah way. Nah. -uh. Yeah. -uh. How do you understand all that math shit coming out of his mouth? We don't! But he helped us out, so who cares? Lord Rindo. Lord Rindo. Yeah. If I may be so bold as to interject, I have studied Lord Tawanami's countenance and temperament quite thoroughly. As such, I believe I am uniquely qualified to comment on his doppelganger's current demeanor. Okay. I sense a substantial difference from when he acted as our erroneous companion. His scent has changed significantly, his scent. Uh, for, uh, forgive my misleading manner of speech, perhaps it would be more accurate to say the look in his eyes. His eyes? They burn as if their, their owner were consumed by some uncharacteristic fiery intensity. As an illustration, it is quite a treat to behold such an unseen sight. However, I fear it may also be a harbinger of some of some grim turn of events. I've witnessed similar phenomena in my in the mines I've delved into a void readily. I may suspect it may relate to the noise. Time to solve this equation. It's those birds. Now converse upon me, noise beyond measure. Wait, those things are noise? Uh oh. Mm. Reversing the flow of time produces this energy consuming trash. What? You mean my time traveling made these things? I've already determined the factor that spurs their multiplication. It seems they're drawn to T differentials, which suggests a degree of interdimensionality. But then their point of origin must be. <clears throat> Look at Mina Mimoto being uh, flexing. Oh no. Are you okay? Lord Rindo, we've an emergency on our hands. Huh? Dot 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 dot. Seriously, beat Tabuti? Why were you looking at his behind? No turning back time now. <laughs> beat! I don't know what kind of bond you think you had with him, but let me tell you, brother don't care about that, yo. Been three years and he ain't changed a bit. There ain't nothing he won't do to get what he wants. What the hell's gotten into him? Maybe that trash noise. What is it doing to him? Doesn't look too friendly to me anymore. We can't... Then we can't afford to go easy on him any either. You've already used your powers once today, right? <clears throat> Ain't no good gonna come from letting him rampage. Don't know what he's after, but we can't let him get it. Let's go, Rindo. Are we sure we can still do this? 
I really got another choice, yo. Tering, jongen. L2 is absolute trash. Doesn't do me anything. Gotta change up the abilities. These are not abilities we can use during this fight. He's gonna do the big explosion again. I also don't think I can actually use Beats Dash here very well. It's not saying equipments are no good. Nah, it's nothing to do with it. It's just that I don't can deal damage to him this way. I had beats use a boar pin in which he did continuous punches. I don't like the continuous punches at all. They suck. But I'm gonna change him around everything. Uh, what's this? Gravity. Let's see. Shotgun is good. It's a good L1. Um. I want another triangle here, but which one? Dash is annoying. Shoka throws miss hate missiles as well. Like, seriously? On fights like this, if there's any, like, charge moves, they suck. Let's just go with this, or nothing is pretty okay. I don't want to use charge 
at all on characters. That uh, when it goes that fast paced. Bombs don't really do much either. That one won't do. There's bully missiles. Yeah, I am gonna do me. <laughs> Still thinking of what would be best though. Dash is not so great here. Laser. Lasers might not be a bad one. This fire is not that great though. Create a wave. Homing rockets, no. Go away. It's also rockets. Rockets. Massive hit. Soul Blaze. This one is already charged, right? Sounds. Massive hit. Proof boost. I think I'm gonna go this. Yeah, should be a fine. Poison? Nah. This I think this is okay. Hey! Back me up here, will ya? He's not on our side anymore, is he? And resemblance to Lord Tomonami has vanished. It appears he's acquired some sort of armor. Uh, what's that mean for us, yo? That we've got to work even harder to kick his ass. Damn, it's like he's reading our every move. It was a calculated counter, indeed. But perhaps if we can use his perfection to our advantage. <laughs> Did not anticipate that. Okay, gonna do the explosion. Yo, cut us some slack, dog! We must relieve him of his armor, lest we endure that assault again. I really need to work on my dodging. He's gonna do explosion again. Oh, thick. 
Okay, I think I understand how to fight this guy. Doesn't make it much easier, but... Nice, got him. <laughs> See you later, Bobo. <clears throat> Think I'm missing run one recipe in TOA. That was uh, quite a rough fight. Gotta be honest. <clears throat> Don't want to go to the washroom. He's unstoppable. No, he's not. What do we do now? Run. That would be advisable. Ain't got no other choice. Then let's scram while we can. Right. Come on. Hey. Might have pushed myself too hard. B, are you okay? Don't stop. Keep going. But what about you? I'm gonna stay here and keep him at bay. What? No, don't leave his beat. I can't give y'all a speed boost right now, so I gotta slow him down instead. You feel? What are you waiting for? Go! And leave you behind? I'm trying to buy y'all some time here, yo! Then what happens when you run out of time? We'll see. No, we won't. There's no way we're letting you face him all by yourself. You're gonna get erased! What? You don't think I can handle him? No, I don't! Defeat is inevitable. Y'all cold, yo. And you're hurt, worms for brains. Worms for brains. Either we all escape together, or we all fight together. Look, I'm gonna need you to chill for a sec. We all stay and fight, we all get erased. Ain't nobody gonna be left to save Shibuya. I'll catch up with you later, but for now, y'all gotta go. Nice and made it seen. <laughs> Sorry, pal. Can't let you through. Beat! Epic. Come on, work. Over my dead body. Neku. Who's that? Neku. Uh. 
Perfect timing, yo. You okay? No way. Who the hell is that? No idea. Here, let me help you. Can't believe you're back. Believe it. Neku! 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 Yeah! And he's not even wearing headphones. You've been this whole time, yo. I looked all over for you. So, who's that guy? An unfamiliar face, to be sure. He's on our side, though, right? Hmm? Uh. <sighs> Who are they? Friends of yours? Yeah, we tight. They's my teammates this time around. We've been playing one hell of a game together, yo. Yo, Rindo, you I? Yeah, we're fine. Neku, Neku, Neku. Don't worry, I'm here to help. Shinjuku got destroyed, but I won't let that happen again. Not here. You're from Shinjuku? <laughs> About time you showed up. Ah, where are my manners? Pleased to meet you. I'm Tosai Furusawa, but you can call me Fred. Who are you? Me. I'm Neku Sakuraba. Well, that voice of his, though. Neku? That's my name. Like, the Neku? Tis the legend himself. Can't say I factored you into the equation. Looks like I'll have to recalculate. Sit your ass back down, Tabooty. Tabooty. <clears throat> All the points were set as variables, but the projected future remains unchanged. Is a transformation even possible? Hey, you, masked septogram. Uh, yes? Something strange about that power of yours. Same goes for that pin you've got there. The cardinality doesn't match the set. Huh? That kind of exponential power isn't meant to be wielded by a mere player. Oh, and what were you planning to use it for? Knowing pie face? Nothing good, yo. Nothing good, yo. Infinity. Always infinity. And if I don't integrate myself with more power, my numbers will get crunched. Right. Not sure I follow. There's someone even more powerful we should watch out for? Huh. The probability exists. As for who You're is drunk. You're easy and drunk. You'll need to solve for yourself. So, Neku. Did you really mean it when you said you'd help us earlier? Of course. I want to help you save Shibuya. That all right with you? Um, of course it is. I mean, how could we say no to the legendary Neku? I can't believe I'm in the presence of greatness. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. But in any case, it's good to be back. It's good to be back. Nice, Neku's back. What is it this time? It's Shibuya. Everything looks so... normal. Was everything I did all for nothing? Huh? Drunk on happy. Finally, man. Like, it took so fucking long before we got to see Neku. He had to return, right? He just had to. And I'm like, uh, when is he coming? When are we gonna find him? Oh, hey, Neku. Hey, Rindo, right? Yeah, good to finally meet you. Even though it won't be for very long. Yeah, he filled me in a bit. Said so beating Shiba will fix everything. We hope. Well, we're gonna have to take him down, that's for sure. But I've got a feeling there's someone else, too. Like who? Whoever's making all that noise. Isn't that Shiva? Hmm. 
might be. It's like another ginger. Yes, finally. The main ginger has returned. Three years ago, I got dragged back into the UG. When I came to, I was in Shinjuku. Or whatever was left of it. The city was already in ruins by the time I arrived. Damn. So Shinjuku really did get erased. Well, it's still there, but it's been cut off from both the RG and the UG. Nobody's there. But it's not completely empty. People's thoughts are still floating around the city like lost souls. What do you mean? You can scan people and see what they're thinking, right? It's kind of like that, except the people themselves aren't around anymore. We already got an update. I tried sifting through some thoughts to find out what happened. And did you come up with anything? Nothing concrete, but I did get a new lead. Gotta follow up on that first. But how? I've got a Reaper friend who's helping me out. I'll try to touch base. A Reaper? Is it Karia? Nah, probably nobody you know. Although, those names sound kind of familiar. Familiar? What? Do you need a smack to jog your memory? Uzuki. Uzuki. Uh, is that what your name was? You really don't remember? First that skull kid and now you too. Unbelievable. The name's Uzuki Yashiro. Try not to forget it this time. Yeah, sorry. Where's Karia? He's resting for now. Dealing with all those noise yesterday really did a number on him. Uh, right. Uh... <laughs> Save your breath. Well, we didn't do it for your sakes, Pipsqueak. Listen, Amnesiac. I mean, Neku. What? I'm really glad you made it back. Okay, <laughs> Dimasaimasen! Karya and I, we're both doing whatever we can to help. So you'd better do your part, too. You got that? Wow, she's really down. I will. That's why I came back. That's why I came back. <gasps> Greetings, sheeple of Shibuya. Fuck you sh with your sheeple. Got some red hot news for you. Sheba, I'm feeling almost frostbitten in the wake of yesterday's party. After all the trouble I went through, to get everyone fired up, too. Although it looks like you all enjoyed yourselves anyway. Color me jealous. Wish I could have personally greeted our newcomer. Welcome back, Neku. <sighs> I've been looking all over for the player of legend to help spice up my little game. I even went to the RG and back to find him. But all I got were these lousy, wicked twisters. <laughs> Who in the world would have thought they'd be the last team standing? <laughs> A scorching hot turn of events, for sure. And I'm not turning down the heat just, just yet. yet. Oops, Expect mom caught me early appearances midnight I started started necking. <laughs> Including the highly anticipated return of a few old flames. Old flames? Stay tuned. <laughs> and with that, I bid you adieu. Ugh, he's so infuriating. I'm gonna go throw up. Neku, take care of things here. And as for you, Window. Uh, yes? You're the leader, aren't you? Start acting like it. Right. Hey! Sup, my dudes? Hey. Alright, let's get this day started. How's it going, Neku? You good? You bet. With the day's broadcast received, we are prepared to march. That being said, what? I worry about the aforementioned old flames. I suspect the game master is rather irate that yesterday diverged so greatly from his plans. And given his temperament, we can expect him to seek revenge using the basest of tactics. Much in the way that after Lady Ayano was erased, he brought tragedy upon our dear Lady Kanon the very next day. Yeah, wouldn't put it past him. Yeah. He can be a real asshole. I don't know what that Shiba's planning, but if he pulls something, we got your back. Me and Phones is here for you. It won't be easy, and it might feel hopeless, but the fate of Shibuya is at stake. We've got to try to save it from Erasure. We're the only ones who can. I must 
emotionally prepare myself. Jeez, Penny, you look like you's going to a funeral. Let's just hope it won't be ours, you know? So, what's the plan? I was just talking with Rindo about that. We're gonna fight the noise. I'm also gonna need your help with something. Which would be... There's something I need to figure out about what happened in Shinjuku. Uh, what about it? I'll explain everything later. Even I'm not completely sure of what I'm looking for yet. Okay. Great. Then let's get going. This Bodell. Judging by the Game Master's words from earlier, not but anguish awaits us. Let my resolve waver if it may. Tis my comrade's morale that worries me. So Shibas had his eye on Neku. He even spent all that time looking for him. Neku must be seriously strong. Huh? Hmm, what's up? Nothing. Glad he's on our side. Got a good feeling with him on the team. Um. If I may, where, pray tell, are we going? Well, I'm trying to get to Cat Streets, and since we're by the station, that means we need to go... Out of the way. Yeah, just follow us. Keep an eye out for the noise. Yeah, sure has changed a lot. Suppose it is pretty different. Can't even tell where the heck I am. No worries, yo. I won't let you get lost. Leave it to me. Well then, lead the way. Cover the truth behind Shinjuku's erasure. Look, Neko's in the team! Neko, Neku. <laughs> I'm seriously kind of hyped. I can't help it. <clears throat> Neku, Neku. Neku. Okay, listen, we're gonna work on changing some shit around again. Um, L1, R1, L2. Grab an L2 or an R2 that we still need to do. It's an L1. Never too young, actually. You know what? Sure. Let's put this one in. Firestorm? This is garbage. Put the L2 in here. Threads. How uh, are Neku's stats, by the way? Unless I have no self-control. Wow, look at Neku's stats, though. You know what? Swap this for something we can actually use. Again, too, should be fine. Auto style. This fit me okay? An interruptible shock resistant attack boost. I still want to change this to Regen, too. Auto style. Ability boost. T affinity. All around it. Oh. Boost, don't care for that. Still want a PP boost. Okay, 
is presentable? Wait. Okay, we're gonna do you custom. Same when you toxic synergy. Health resilience. This one. Hi, can we be friends? Lizzie, aren't we already friends? Pro tag partners. Sometimes increase the groove earned from beats drop combos between Neku and Rindo. Sure. Said we were friends. You already know it's a trap. Can't be that big of a trap. Let's move. Everyone is hungry. Hola, señores! of my people oh shit wait you never called me your friend said okay oh, don't follow sq because you're gonna lose your follow time again you baka of course you're also my friend hola senores Mochos, gracias! Okay, so no friends to find. Hey there. Fizz is done as well, I think, right? Let's Let's see what kind of fights are here. Two big bears, three big bears should be fine. Too? I'll drink my tears in alcohol. You can drink, you're fine. Let's do it to it, yo. Yeah. 
Booyah! Lizzie Mommy won't even let me drink Slam's face in mud. Aw, oh, she made a mini spa. <laughs> Are the kitties back? the other dog. There it is. <laughs> the charge kicks are pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Let's bring the pain, yo. It's time. Let's blow them all up. Thank <laughs> you. 
Never touch me again. I'm not your mother's biggest fan. Don't be mad. Don't be mean. Otherwise, I'll break your teeth. Nice. Oh god, seriously? But at least we can get rid of this one. Let's go with R2. I was working on this one for a while. Not your mother's biggest pain. Me, 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 me. Hey. Can I ask you something? Shoot. So Shinjuku, what's it like now? Now? Now it's just nothing. All that's left are shadows, faint impressions of people and their thoughts. I'm a pervert! Rude. That's it, Grim. Are you not freaking out? Your whole town just went poof. I mean, it doesn't exactly make me feel warm and fuzzy inside, but I low-key like it better here in Shibuya anyway, so yeah, I'm good. Glad to hear it. What the hell were you doing in that part of Tokyo in the first place? Beats me. Someone wanted me there, though. I just know it. Someone like who? Again, beats me. Pull up. Now I got the question. How did she wind up back here? Is that easy to rock up to the Buya these days? Reaper found me, sought me out, told me Shibuya could use my help. Fortunately, they were kind enough to show me the way back. Was it truly so simple? This gallant Reaper pointed you down the streets and uh, away you went? It wasn't a street so much as a... well, sort of hard to explain. At any rate, when I got here, something fell off. And I looked to see what it was. Sure. You found us? Yep. Seriously, yo? Luckily, you showed up when you did. Hate to say it, but the booty really had me on the ropes. Hey. Okay, my turn. Or on the subject, what the he what's the deal with Mr. Minami? Like, who is he? Nassel, that's who. Three years ago, he was a Reaper-sized thorn in our side. Brought us all QET, and we're all, what the fuck? My advice, don't bother trying to figure him out. <laughs> Wasn't gonna. Let's just say we didn't see eye to eye on certain subjects when we first met. Taking that to mean you guys had it out. More or less, but he's not the same person anymore. He changed. Changed? You gotta be kidding me. Ain't you seen him back there? I know, I know, but remember how crazy he used to be? Something tells me he's different, or trying to be at least. So, he is on our side? No, he ain't. Guy's a freak, a weirdo, probably a serial killer to boot. <laughs> Listen, there's more at stake here than Minami Moto's friendship. We have a city to save, remember? Right. You got anything new for sale? Oh my god. Guardian Glaives. Another one of these garbage things. Sure, I'll buy. See you around. See you around. Shoka, something wrong? Yeah, what the fuck is... It's Ayano, she's here. What? But how? How should I know? Don't be fooled, that is not the Reaper we encountered the other day. What do you mean? I cannot see into her mind. Shoka, there you are, dear. She has none. She's but an empty husk. What you figured? Clearly walking and talking just fine. Are you sure it's not her? Let me scan her. Might be a hint somewhere in her soul. Yeah, you can scan people's soul? Picked up a few tricks while I was in Shinjuku. Couldn't exactly scan people the old-fashioned way. I guess right, there's no soul there, she's empty. Shoka, let's go back. Darling, to get her. Completely lost herself, now she's just noise. Even after someone's gone, their thoughts and memories can get left behind. I bet it, my bet is the noise has latched onto some of hers, absorbed her leftovers, thoughts, and took on her appearance. So that's just noise pretending to be I, you know? Pretty sure. At the very least, it's not her. It's just noise. Shoka, come with me, dear. Now I get it. Old flames. How cruel. So that's what he meant. People who've been erased, they're coming back. You're the worst. You're the absolute worst, you know that, Shiba. I know it sucks, but we gotta fight her. I yeah, know, right? Really freaking sucks. 
Do we actually gotta go into a wolf fight for her again? She's just gonna be some random noise. Okay, oh my god, yeah, it's some random noise, some garbage-ass random noise. This is really bad. That was not exactly what I had in mind. Get rid of the stupid dog. I shouldn't even call it a dog. Dogs are way better than that stupid thing. Calling it a dog would be a mistreatment against the dogs. Yordi, did you know that you're doing an absolute terrible job of dodging today? <laughs> what kind of goodie bag? I kind of want to go downstairs to my mailbox because there's candy in there that my mom stole from me with the groceries but brought back. But that would mean that I need to go down and stop playing game. And it's a folder. Ah, oh, damn it. See? Ugh. Disgusting. Okay, yeah, we can change Nekus. Later, Faker. Um, Lady Shoka, what? I recommend this application to you. It has healed many of my wounded hearts. Elegant strategy. Elstar. <laughs> I shan't force it upon you. I simply think it might help take your mind of unpleasant matters. Characters are simply incredible and the gameplay boasts surprising depth. <laughs> hmm. Thanks, sis. Fine for now, but I'll try it out when I need to pick need to pick me up. Hope it helps. Now then, onwards. <sighs> Just great. Thanks, anyways. Ugh, apparently, I can't call you, so I have to text you instead. Zuki. I take it you saw today's noise. All the team leaders are back. They staked out their turf across the city. Don't know what your plan is from here, but be careful. There's a good chance you'll run into them, so watch your back. Got it, got it. Thank you kindly. What'd she say? That the erased players are coming back. Being revived as noise, which means we're in a, for a fight or two. By the way, I got a hold of that Reaper I told you about. I still need to get the cats straight. Alright, we can head that way. Let's just hope we can make it without running into trouble. Let's hope so. Okay, let's grab another... 
L2. Lizzie. Oh, sorry, dinner came right as I joined earlier. <laughs> Don't believe it, Sushi. You just abandoned me. <laughs> hey, Sushi, welcome back. How was dinner? Rindo HP boost 5. Nice. Open hand. I don't want to waste my money. Do you know all that happened with Neku? No, not yet. Other than he was in Shinjuku all this time. That's why we couldn't find him. Din Din was good. Is that Fuya? Sure looks like him. Certainly does. Fuya? Alright, you weren't around for that. He was one of the team leaders who got a raise before he showed up. So, Wicked Twisters, come to rain on my parade once more. If he got erased, then he ain't got no business being back here. Guess I'll have to blow you out of the water. You need gonna fight him more what? Poor guy. Yeah, we have to, right? Lord Rindo, remember, this is not the real Fuya. He has no mind or soul to speak of. We mustn't let our emotions hinder us from finishing the task before us. Let our justice be swift. Alright, let's go. I don't want to meet Kanon again. I feel sad if I think of Kanon. Okay, no dogs this time. That's good. I really don't like Kines is the fact that the damage output is so incredibly random. I was such a nice person. Wait, wait, Yordi. So your building has candy? I have candy hidden away. Yes. Kana was such a nice person. She deserved better. Yeah. And she had very nice tits. Uh, I mean, uh, personalities. No, I really like Kana. I like that she like tried to improve in uh, Fret as well the entire time. Well, I was like, oh, Fret is just being nice and such. And like, what? He's not being genuine, and it's like, Ugh! I like that. I really like that. <laughs> Fucking Rory. <Rudy. laughs> Sorry, I gotta gotta keep at it, man. <laughs> if one doesn't make jokes, one's just gonna be sad, and one doesn't want to be sad. So jokes, it is. Yeah, no. Yeah, he pretty much had the same trauma as Neku. So it went in the complete opposite direction. Yep.
Not that I remember much of Neku's trauma, though. Also, Neku's voice is so much different from what it used to be. He's got this low-ass, fucking badass voice now. Like, what the frick? Jordy, I thought you said you like butts. I do like butts. I also like tits very much. Both those things can put a very sm very happy smile on my face. That's that then. Guess so. Shall we proceed? Might as well. Don't really have any other options. Yeah, for real. Just gotta keep going. Indeed. I'm telling you, man. This game is whack. Not that ours was much better, but still. Yeah. Reapers gave us a hell of time back then. No kidding, but man. Never thought I'd wind up back in the UG with you. Why are you here anyway? Don't tell me you got yourself killed again. Nah, even ain't, even I ain't that stupid, then why? Them Shinjuku Reapers have been pulling people from the RG. That's how they got me, same with Rindo and them. Um, wait, you came straight from the RG? Yeah, Pinky said we was violating the rules of realism or some shit. It's just like back when you up and disappeared. Now it's like we never existed at all back home. Did Shinjuku Reapers do this? Who else could have been? Fair enough. Something to look into, at least. I'm gonna ask that Reaper you was talking about. Who is he? And it's anyways, you'll see soon enough. Is it Mr. H? Is Mr. H back? Uh, Mr. H was an angel, right? Wasn't a Reaper. Why can't I know now? Because it'll be easier to explain everything all at once. Well, is it somebody I know? Like it matters, but still. I just want to see some familiar face, you know? Me too. This makes me wish everyone else was here. No kidding. I hope they all do alright. Especially, you know? Yeah. If we make it out this game live, we ought to have a reunion. What do you mean if we make it out? Are we busting out of here, yo? Yeah, for sure. Got Nicolas Cage type voice now. I'd say more of a Markiplier kind of voice when he's like doing the handsome thing. Fucking Motoy. Motoy was a bitch, man. Sush, what do you think? What What was your opinion when you fit when you realized what Motoy was doing? Like Motoy was such a fucking. Nothing but pity. He was so pathetic. Yeah. Once he was explaining that he uh, like stole those quotes, I was like, oh man, he's the that NFT guy that picks that steals people their uh, random art and then sells it for as NFTs on the internet. Like. <laughs> Here we go. Hi, mi amigo! UK Rinduth, aye. Nothing remains of the man we knew. He is not but noise now. Noise must be erased. She's right, nothing but noise. What's wrong, amigo? Come on, you can't do this. Lord Rindo. If I may, we can handle this on our own if it's too much for you to bear. You can dive inside to know this creature is nothing but an empty shell, which makes today's ordeals far less psychologically taxing on me than trials past. Oh, well, you're really on top of it today, boss. Because she worried about this dummy. She senses how this is affecting us. Huh? What are you hawing about? She can obviously tell we're struggling. She's really good at reading people, and not just because of her powers. You've got a point. Hey. Well, fearless leader, you gotta make Nagi fight your battle for you? What? No way. Rindo. You don't have to do this if you really don't want to. We should be able to handle him on our own. Show. Yeah, he won't even know what hit him. Nah, it's okay. 
I can fight. And let us prepare for battle, Lord Rindo. Nagi, Nagi's great though. Nagi is amazing. Calling everyone Lord. Or Lady. <laughs> Welcome back, Sap. I think I'm gonna blow these guys up. It's too much damage that I need to deal. I'm gonna move for that shite. Lix is Lizzie's evil twin. How was your Chinese, uh, Sep? Ah, oh, really? Look out below! Okay, let's get the cat stream, right? Hell yeah, here we come, Cat Street. All those noise are gonna get beat. Next threat to appear before us will doubtless be Canon Yo Penny. Worried about fret? Me the next. <clears throat> oh, wherefore must you destination be so far away? Huh? Alright. Lex is killing me already, yo. It's truly lamented indeed. But it's we're only closer. Nothing to get down about though. You know, I've been thinking this week's a lot tougher than I thought it'd be. Is that so? I know I talk a big game, but I was worried I could really follow through. I am more though. No, I can do it, yo. This Lord Neku has joined our ranks. Yeah. That's right. You certainly place great faith in him. Damn right. Damn straight, I do. Also reading. Take Chinese classes. Like language. Yeah, same. I thought you. I thought we both heard food. He does strike me as trustworthy, seeing as he's a legendary who saved Shibu. Nah, that ain't way. No, ain't got nothing to do with legends or any of that shit. I knew him way before all that, yo. I trust him because I know he's a good guy. A good friend would seem. He's around. Everything just feels different, you know. He's got that kind of power, and that's why I know we can do this. Ain't a damn thing to worry about with him around. This wondrous sight to behold, the fruit from friendship born. Money! Break up. Wake up. Appreciation. Any new? No. Time for us to real. No, Canon. She's here, Canon. <laughs> Fret, Rindy. Man, Shiba doesn't pull any punches. Way to kick a down a guy while he's down. Gonna butter me up again today. Not exactly what I meant when I said I wish we had more time together. The figure before you is nothing more than noise. It's not Lady Canon. That is not Lady Canon. You already said that. It bears repeating. Say it again. That is not Lady Canon! <laughs> Sorry. Again! Today I ate mashed potatoes, chickens, and sour cream, mushroom sauce, and veggies. It was mixed kind of spicy pickled cucumber with, how do you guys call it, Beijing cabbage? We use tomatoes and olive oil. Yeah, me too. I once made gong bao ji thing. Gong bao chicken. Gotta season the meat. I can't stand Chinese food. It gives me... It literally gives me diarrhea. As bad as that sounds. That is not Lady Canon! Again! That is not Lady Canon! Thanks, boss. You may thank me after the battle, will you fight? <laughs> I will. No need to ask me twice. Sure. 
And now I need to go after the wolves now that I weakened. And, uh, jellyfish. At least I can figure out which one is which. If they decide to split. But I don't know if they do that, these ones. The other stupid dog. Oh, I missed it. Sand. I got you. Yes. I poop chicken nuggets. Jordi is a cardiac, cardiac dysfunction food lover. Wait, what? Cardiac dysfunction food lover? A heart attack enthusiast? That was about me. Damn, son. Mm -hmm. We did it. It's over. Uh -huh. Indeed. <sighs> hey, boss. Thank you for helping me out back there. I never thought I'd have you talking to me, let alone pulling me like that. I just figured you kind of hated me or something. It is true, I admit, that I struggle to get along with creatures of your affinity, I've noticed. That being said, through our shared trivials, I have come to see beyond the surface. You have? Yes, and I would like to believe I have discerned the true you permits me to demonstrate. Huh? Lady Cannell was your... Bias, as we Elistranyechix, I can pronounce that, might say. Bias. As such, it is perfectly natural that her passing would affect you deeply. And for it to happen so suddenly, your despair doubtless runs deep. Did you dive inside my mind or something? Not at all. And I resent you suggesting I would do such a thing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> There is much to be learned by observing one's actions, even without delving into their minds. I have simply observed you for the past few weeks, then drawn conclusions based on what I've seen. Conclusions, are they? You truly wish to know? If you're willing to share? Well then, I've concluded you are in fact human. Huh? Took you this long? <laughs> Allow me to elaborate. Humanity is the difference between making an effort to understand those around themselves versus viewing them merely as resources to be consumed. Humanity is the difference between trying to understand opinions and values divergent from one's own 
versus scoffing and dismissing them as meritless. Humanity is the difference between being fraught with fear when facing others versus being blighted, unconcerned with others altogether. And now having discerned your humanity, I can safely infer that in this moment, you're suffering in a great deal of pain. Thanks for the analysis. I thought you had such a good read on me. It's actually kind of amazing to be honest. <laughs> Perhaps. Nagi hype! Seriously, the way that she talks, that's probably the best thing about this game. I'm simply aware of the importance of communication. And I take great pains to ensure my interactions with others remain as peaceful as possible. Asking questions, gauging responses, reacting aptly. I leverage every element at my disposal, actions, words, emojis, anything at all, to ensure everyone feels welcome. Fuck you, Lizzie, which you don't like Nagi. Pfft, how can you not like Nagi? Nagi's great! This is a skill that can be practiced and honed like any other. No need to rely on special powers. Hehe. <laughs> I'm gonna be real with you, got a little lost there for a second, as expected, but it's really amazing that you can do all that. I don't really get it, but I respect it. In a similar vein, I admire the ease with which you can carry on a conversation with anyone and everyone. I simply struggle to get along well with creatures of your type. Seriously? After all that? <laughs> Bitch, I'm entitled to my opinions. And my opinions is I don't like my <laughs> Opinions don't exist. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm glad we got that all out in the open. It's almost like we're friends or something. Maybe I'll try out a fancy strategy game. Or whatever it's called, the one you're always talking about. Ho ho ho. Shant holds you back. I hope you'll find it to your liking. I'm actually surprised she says, uh... I hope you find it to your liking and not like, HOW DARE YOU NOT PRONOUNCE IT CORRECTLY! We can, At least we can see who the true powerful people are here, and not us Kingdom Hearts fans. That will disgrace everyone. Axius2000 tells me to go get chocolate milk. Dang it. I just had one. Okay. Because you ask so nicely. <clears throat> Chalky, chalky, chocolate milk. Uh. Axios, how are you doing? And welcome back, I should say, probably. Cat Street, it's been ages. Really? I think it was yesterday that we were here. Yo, phones, we going where we think we going? Or is that? Sure. If you think we're going where you, I think you think we're going, then yes. Although, I doubt we'll be seeing any Mr. H. Uh, what? Someone I know used to run a coffee shop around here. He's probably long gone by now, but we're not going to see him. We'll be meeting with my Reaper friend there. Reaper friend, you say? Yep. Mind if we get going? Mr. H! Mr. H was dope. Hey, I kind of cool? dislike it that we don't get to see Mr. H again. Hey, Coco! Wait, she's friend? Like, hey. Yoo-hoo, over here! There you are, Neku! You're late, have you any idea how long I've been waiting? Pixie chick? Ah, what the hell are you doing here? 
Not like I wanted to see your frilly ass neither. <laughs> she the Reaper we've been looking for? Just chill for a sec, B. Right, so this is... You all must be the Wicked Twisters. I'm ever so pleased to meet you. What the fuck is Nagi? Nagi is one of the characters in this game sub. Have you not been paying attention these past couple of 45 hours? She's way too sparkly. I am the most adorable Reaper slash Fairy Princess in all of Shibuya. Pixie chick. God damn it. Coco Atarashi. <laughs> if you aren't careful, I'll charm you to death. Coco! Yay! That ain't funny, yo. Especially not after what you did to Neku. I ain't forget, yo. Uh, what did she actually... What did she do? Indeed. That's an excellent question. No, give a fuck about names. Okay, set bro. I like this sword chick, one that was pretending to be a reaper. Sword chick that was pretending to be a reaper. I don't like. Coco really evolved from scene queen to pastel goth. Yeah. <laughs> Um, uh, I'm cur I'm curious how this all translates into going well, because from what I from the freaking story of uh, what was it called again? The epilogue of uh, the world ends with you. She was kind of the one trolling around, beat a Neku right, and being the evil person. Mm -hmm. All I got out of that was she's a Shibuya Reaper. Beat, will you come down so I can explain? What's there to explain? The reason Coco did what she did. I think it was called. Yeah, New Day. Why she shot me, why she tricked us both, why she tried dragging us into the UG three years ago. It was all to save Shinjuku. Wait, but she's from Shibuya, and she was trying to save Shinjuku? Huh? Precisely! I couldn't possibly sit back and allow Shinjuku to be destroyed. Oh yeah, because Koko is probably one of the most powerful Reapers out there, right? Like last stream, Sword Chick. You mean, uh, Shoka? The cat one. Where? She doesn't have a sword! Where the... Okay, Shoka, you like Shoki, it's fine. <laughs> Mr. H said something about being her being uber powerful, Coco. It. Like, I give a shit why you done it. No excuse for trying to trick us and trying to kill my friend. Oh, Will you shut up? <laughs> you have no freaking idea what I've been through to get here, festering sack of garbage. <laughs> Neku, I literally cannot with him. <laughs> Talk about touching reunion. Shoka, she actually was a Reaper. Yeah, was. Bad at listening and remembering games. I don't personally play, sorry. <laughs> um, it's fine, Sep, as long as you're here. You only like her because she's cat enemy. Coco's great, yeah. Sorry, this got to be confusing for all of you. That's eh, putting it lightly. Basically, Coco was really desperate to save Shinjuku from being destroyed. Huh? But why? She's from Shibuya. It's not like she had any stake in what went down. Well, I couldn't simply ignore her cry for help. From whom? My dear friend in Shinjuku, she told me the situation was quite bleak. Which is why I pulled this pauper and prince in to help me out. But unfortunately, we were too late. Shinjuku was already gone. That friend of yours, you found her, right? Yes. She has a note to stay to speak with us at the moment, though. Oh, who is she? Not a Reaper or something? I think she used to be one, but she was back to being a player three years ago. She was Shinjuku's sole survivor, aside from the Reapers, that is. And then once she crossed over, she became a Reaper again. At least I think so. Uh, how I wish I could tell us what happened. 
Oh! My dear sweet Sugumi. Wait, what? Sugumi? Yeah, that makes sense why she suddenly appeared in, like, uh, at the end scene there as well. What she had to do with everything. Sinkoko on the promotion for this and being like, You bitch, tell me what you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tsugumi? Yes, and given the sorry state of this little fellow, I fear my friend may be in similar dire strait. What's up, some kind of pig? It's a cat, remember? We've been over this warm for brains, it's a cat! Neku's so much chiller now as well. <laughs> Alright, my bad. <laughs> His name is Mr. Mew. Um, how do you know about Gato Nero? You've been gone for years. Gato what? Never heard of it. Yes, you have. Like, you know Mr. Mew, which is literally Gato Nero. Plus, you're wearing it right now. See? Gato Nero right there. What's this? Duh, it's like the most popular brand. Everyone knows it. Wait, did, uh, did Shiki make it so... Make for brand that... Quickly, in three years? Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. That's wild. When did Mr. Mew get so popular? Hold up, I heard that name before. You definitely have, although you've never been very good at remembering it. This is the stuffed animal that Cheeky made. Oh, shit! How could I now only lay that... Only just now make that link? Fuck my life! I thought... I literally... I haven't played that game in forever. I literally thought... That she just owned a plush of it, and that was already a thing back then. Shiki was it? Yeah. She was my first partner back when I was playing the game. She controlled this little guy with her mind and used him to fight the noise. And we know he can pack a punch. Over here. Do you know where she is now? Aww. None of Shibuya. I hear work has been keeping her away. Right. Oh, uh, I'm such an idiot. As soon as I seen Gato Nero in 104 at the start of the game, I was like, oh, yeah, no, that, that took me way too long. It literally, they literally had to spell it out for me just now. That was so bad. I lit, like, I was lit thinking that she was just, uh, that she just had a plush of it at this point. And I didn't actually think she would pull it off within three years. That's sick. Till she returns, speaking with Tsugumi is all but impossible. Shiki is the only one who can fix this. Hmm? Hold up, I don't get it. And what is it you don't get? What exactly can she fix? By Mr. Mew, of course. And what would accomplish what now? I don't see how that relates to Tsugumi. Oh dear. I thought you would have known all about her situation, seeing as you're Shinjuku Reaper. This doll contains Tsugumi's heart and soul. What? Fortunately, this poor dear is in tatters, which is why she can't get through to us. Trying, to com trying as we might, communicating with her now is almost impossible. Hmm. We gotta find a way to help her. She's the only one who knows what really happened back in Shinjuku. If we can get her to tell us about it, we might be able to stop it from happening here in Shibuya too. Oh. Well, I might have an idea. Care to share with the class? Hey, Nagi. Oh crap, that was way too fast. Do you think you can dive in there and talk to her? Must all this fall upon my shoulders? Sounds like you've got some pretty impressive powers, Nagi. Hold up, yo. Now you're trying to dive inside a doll? More like Tsugumi's mind inside the doll. Um, what? Can you really do that? <laughs> That's simply stupendous! I love the bait and switch, though. Okay, you gotta explain that one to me. I don't understand the bait and switch. Oh, I have ever so many questions for for you to relay. What happened? How can we fix it? And let's see. Ah, yes. Is there anything we should be wary of? Be a dear and ask her for your favorite fairy princess. No, I, I actually did not anticipate Mr. H coming back. 
That is definitely something I uh, anticipated that he would not come back. <laughs> it appears I have no choice in the matter. Uh, you doing okay, boss? I'm fine. Does your face say it's otherwise? Deep breaths. To dive into a mind such as this, to see all the burdens she must bear, this shall be quite the undertaking. Everyone is counting on me! And I then shut them low! Wait, what? And then shed them low. Okay, I don't think that is correct, but sure. Get it together, sis. Don't worry, boss. You got this. Probably. Poor Nagi. Nagi's great. Oh. Too late. It's all over. Somebody, anybody. I can't move. I'm trapped. Somebody, do something. Huh? That voice. Is that Sugumi? Right. We can hear what she's thinking now that we're inside her mind. If she were taken over by noise, then we'd have to fight them at some point. Sooner than later from the looks of it. Brace yourself, huh? It's coming. Let me out. I'm trapped. I don't want to be alone anymore. Long has she been like this? As long as... That noise has been keeping her sealed away. Noise? Oh god, is that a... I don't know who put it in here, but we're taking it out. I suppose combat is See, this is this is one of the noise that I really hate. Hate. Oh my god, this is worse. Seriously? A plague noise? And an elephant version. That is absolutely disgusting. Okay, yeah, we're now we're just gonna blow it up. Plague fans. Yeah, no, I, d I already hate the ele fighting the elephants, but fighting a plague version of it that's even worse. I can't even kill these frogs before. <laughs> Did they even deal with any damage? I can't even see. Where is this HP? I didn't even hit it. It's fucking disgusting. Oh, ow. Ow, that hurt. You know I will say, it's Shocker Neku so chill true. You already is on a roller coaster ride after spending three years in a dead town. It's like disappointed. Okay. It's annoying that I can only get the beat drops to appear or with me. Uh, with my boy right now. Oh, 
Oh, shit. Oh, he's weak against that. That's nice. Good to know. Okay, nice. Land it. Well, you know what they say. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. They are the harder they eat. Stomach can fit. Wait, what? It's still make them drop. Harder is to make them. Wait, why? <laughs> I don't get it. So she has me confused. We got him at least. What? That's all that matters. Yay, we can replace one for Neku again. Did we do it? Think so. Whoa, boss. You look like you're gonna pass out. It's as if every last droplet of my energy has been sapped. But it paid off. Thanks, Nagi. Can you keep us in here a little longer? I want to talk to Tsugumi now that the noise is gone. But I don't think we can communicate with her from the outside while Mr. Mew's all torn up. This might be our only chance to chat for now. Think you can manage, Nagi? Of course. I shall maintain our connection. Thank you. Oh. I appreciate you going out of your way to help me. Tsugumi! You're the one who called out to me and showed me the future. Aren't you? Wait, the future? You mean like all those visions I keep getting? Oh, so you saw them too. You're right. It was I who sent those visions out into the world. And it seems you two received them. I pick up signals sent by your future selves. And relay those signals to you as warnings here in the present. So those visions are from me? Huh? Future me did what in the wind now? <laughs> Shush! I'll dumb it down for you later. I'll dumb it down for you later. Why the future like that? To help you survive, but also to help you save the city from Shiba. Now that Shinjuku's gone, Shibuya's his next target. Yes. The noise he spawned are capable of phasing between the UG and the RG. I really liked it after all the shit Nagi and gave Fred through the game. It was her who was there. Yeah, no, that was absolutely great. And that's what triggered the inversion. Inversion? Like... It got turned upside down? More like the UG and RG fused into one, effectively canceling each other out. I saw it happen in Shinjuku, but there's no way a regular Reaper could pull that off. That's the work of a higher power. Indeed. It's dissonance, just like Shiva's abilities. Uh, dissonance? It defies the rules of reality. You came to the UG without dying. But neither a player nor a reaper could have made that happen. That's dissonance. But if not a player or a reaper, then who? What is going on here? This is above even the game master's pay grade. Only the composer could deal with a royal mess like this. So where does this dissonance come from then? I'm sorry. 
But I don't know. I wish I did. I nearly got erased trying to find out. All I know for sure is that this dissonance is very real. <sighs> and that dissonance is what destroyed Shinjuku. Thanks. You've been a big help. Good thing you're hanging on, even if it's by a thread. If it weren't for Mr. Mew, you might have been erased by now. Yeah. Listen, Rindo, Neku, I'm glad you two were able to receive my messages. But they weren't just warnings for your sake. They were also my way of asking for your help. I wasn't able to save Shinjuku. But it isn't too late to save Shibuya. <sighs> Shibuya. I don't know what's going to happen to me. There's a very real chance I might be trapped in this doll forever. So please, do what I can't. Don't worry, we will. That's a promise. And once Shiki makes it back to Shibuya, we'll get you out of here. That's... very kind. Good luck out there. <laughs> Welcome back! So, how did it go? Were you able to speak with her? Yeah. Splendid for us! And does my darling his friend alright? What did she say? She's fine. She didn't have all the answers, but it's a start. She was gotta go, that's for sure. But it sounds like taking him down will be tough. How am I supposed to help? Aw, if only I could have spoken to her myself. You can talk later. She's not going anywhere. I need a Shinjuku game. I need to know what the fuck happened. <laughs> you beat the game, so that doesn't get completely answered. I guess. We'll find her once this is all over. I still end up having to start over anyway. Hell yeah, we will. Gotta save Shibuya first, though. Is that because of the dissonance, too? Otherwise, we'll have nowhere to meet up. Right, Rindo? Huh? We can't let Shibuya get destroyed. Like it did in that vision. Oh, yeah, right. Even if it does get destroyed, maybe I'll get a second shot at avoiding that, too. Don't want that to become our future. But what about... Swallow. Huh. Left on rent. I also want to know who the fuck Swallow is. Fuck, I. Sorry. It's fine. <laughs> I was it's technically not really a spoiler. It's just something that we will keep having a question about. Jumping into people's minds like that? Harnessing my powers is simply a matter of deducing information from others, then using it to create a more complete picture of another's mind within my own. Well, actually, it's not particularly detrimental to me, at least not in any insurmountable sense. Oh, really? Nay, what I truly struggle with is the pressure. Ah, so that's what it is. I tend to perform my worst precisely when it is most critical I succeed. It is a bad habit I cannot seem to correct. Not sure that's something you can help, though. Perhaps not. Well, hey, at least it worked out this time. Shiba changed. He wasn't always like this. Not until three years ago, at least. What happened? I think I went secret note collecting. Oh, yeah, I think I, I might actually complete this game if I'm going to be completely honest, like, get everything. But I'm not 100% sure about that. What's up, SQ? What do you mean, seriously? <laughs> I've only got two secret notes so far. I tried fighting the Super Balls in Ultimate. It fucked you in the butt. It, uh... <laughs> it hurt your butthole. <laughs> I still want to know who Swallow is. We'll figure it out at some point, hopefully, huh? What do you know? The Wicked Twister is still at it, but not for long. I say it's time to flip him up for good! Hey, bro. What's it? About tomorrow's game. You gotta keep bringing that up. What do you mean? I can handle it just fine. 
Hello, yeah, I'm back. When can we meet? Are you free now? Alright, got it. No worries, I'll be waiting. Literally one shot, nice. Nothing, can't spoil it. Good. What was Beat's sister's name again? Why can I not remember her name? Up where? Yo, Rindo, this ain't good. Rhyme, thank you. Rhyme, it's all messed Where's up. Here? No way. This can't be real. Is that Shibuya? Shibuya? What about Shibuya? What's gonna happen to the city? Rhyme. I think we've been seeing Rhyme pop up here and there as well. Today's Not an actual facial yet. Today's grim. future is looking pretty grim. Turning back time will do the trick. Which reminds, Which reminds me. me. What was it Minami Moto said about those noise that show up when I use my powers? The set doesn't match the something. Wait a sec. That kind of exponential power isn't meant to be wielded by a mere player. Does that mean you came to the UG without dying? But neither a player nor a reaper could have made that happen. That's dissonance. I've been... Sup, Rin dude? Sup, Rin dude? Lunatic Shiba today? Guess so. Uh. Oh, great. Here come the morning announcements. Greetings, Greetings people of Shiba. Sheeple. Got some red hot news for you. I see yesterday's gifts reached you safe and sound. Did they bring back any warm memories? More like the worst memories, jerk. And now we've reached the penultimate day, which may prove to be Shibuya's penultimate day as well. But you won't find out what tomorrow brings unless you survive what I have in store for you today. You'll have to go through the fire if you want to save this forsaken city. Some so cards. be my guest. Give it a shot. Drinking two chocolate milk so quickly after each other is not so good. Time until the city's flame gets snuffed, though. <laughs> Ugh. And with that, I bid you adieu. Man, I am so ready for all this to be over. Me too. Me three, bro! To tell you the truth, I'm getting sick of all these rematches. I'm ready to pack up the board and bounce. Susukichi! So, I hear you discs found Neku for real this time. Let me get a good look at him. <laughs> Ain't that something? What's the matter? You scared, yo? Looks like Neku's got you shaking in your shoes, hater skater. There you go again. Some discs never change. Since when did he skate? He doesn't. He misunderstood an offer to go around on his board. So you're the legendary Neku. A real frontier disc by the looks of it. I can see why the boss wanted to meet you so bad. So what? You just come here to look? Or was you here for a fight too? Cause if you want it, you got it, yo! <laughs> I'm not making any loud moves. Not this time. I was just hoping you discs would play a little game with me. I feel like I've heard that before. He said something similar shortly after I joined. And shortly after that, he made complete fools of us. We fell right into his trap. What a tool. Hate to break it to you, big guy, but we're gonna have to take a rain check. Only game we've got time for right now is the game. What's in it for us? What happens if we win? You gonna give us a prize or something? <laughs> Sharp as ever, Shoka. <laughs> Here's the deal. If you win, I'll get your discs a meeting with the boss. You'll take us to Shiba? I mean, you got no clue where it is, right? Well, it's gonna stay- What a boss! I need to go to the toilet! <laughs> Holy shit. And there's no telling what had happened to this region then. You just ain't got any other moves you can make, so what do you say? Hey, Rindo. Yeah? I think we should play along. Even I don't know where Shiva is. And we don't have time to waste looking for him. Can we really trust him, though? Yeah. I think so. Alright. Kendall just Fine. destroy his ass. Come on, Suzukichi. <laughs> Guess you've developed a little competitive spirit after all. Let's get started, then. Unless any of you discs want to go against your leader. <clears throat> Badaboom! 
Well, I hope you like hide and seek, cause you're it. Again? <laughs> Try to have some fun with it. And don't keep me waiting too long. Your move, wicked twisters. Your move, twisters. He just vanished. Shiva said things were heating up. He must have sent the noise. Susukichi's using it to hide again. The same way he did last week. We've got to find him quick. Come on. Yeah, let's get moving. The sooner we find him, the better. What's this? Don't tell me. Susukichi sent another selfie. Fucking crossing, that's way too obvious. Afraid so, damn, he already made it to Scramble Crossing. His Pictionary prowess seemed to have improved at least, you think? It's far less blurry than before. Hey, you're right. Maybe he's been practicing. I don't like Suzuki Ching. Suzuki is fucking trash. Okay, give me a sec. I'm gonna be a B. Okay, real talk, really glad that I decided to play Yu-Gi-Oh today, but I'm also really glad that I Lethal Legend, sometimes the Grease Groove, nice, but I'm also really glad that I decided to like uh, split today, that I'm like going live earlier than usual. Like we've been already been live for 10 and a half hours. Purely because we were playing Yu-Gi-Oh! before, and now we're playing Neo. Ooh, we can actually go Suzukichi route. Shit. Wait. Um, fonts? Any side quests? Just one. Tower Records. Hmm. 
pain to find and make it easy for us, huh? Yeah, got a feeling these guys are even tougher than they look. Damn. Real? Guess that means you and me better pace ourselves then. Save some strength for when to finally face sure. off to Chiba, yo. True. But we gotta find him first. Well, he ain't, he ain't here, so I say we bounce. But first, let's pound these punks. Alright, watch yourselves, everyone. Don't do anything stupid. Oh my god, this looks terrible. Smash! Out. Dodged. Good job, Yordi. Are we awesome or what? I forgot to replace that pin for Neku. I think we're getting the hang of handling these things, perhaps, but we mustn't grow comp complacent. Aye aye, boss. Wish you'd just tell me instead of playing these stupid games. Who tell you what? Wish Suzukichi would just tell us where Shibo is. Well, last time I checked, he's not exactly on our side. Yeah, not exactly. Good mood gravitation. 
as well. Hey, you hungry? Famished. This seems like a good one. Well, wow, nobody likes this. What the fuck? Grilled alligator. Oh no. Gives the biggest eight attack boost on everyone. How can you not like it? Okay, let's be real. I wouldn't want to try and eat grilled alligator either. I'm surprised that Nagi likes it though, like, what the frick? And now we again. Man, I am <gasps> Fucking six style points up, Jesus. Defense. Boost it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Change the ring already, which is good. Center Street. Let's move. Well, I don't know if I if you know, but I don't know either. Tell me. Don't tell me. So much for finding him at crossing. What? Where are you at now, yo? Express underpass. Guess that's our next stop. See, so always do this cat and mouse stick with you, more or less. He sends photograph. We do this location, begin our pursuit. So it's fun for him, seriously. Oh yeah, he loves a good game. Reversey to name but one. Hold up, I thought he was skater, yo. I think you might got the wrong impression. <laughs> he may have been pretending to be a player in this game, but that smile on his face was 100% real. He loves competition. Mm. Comes down to it, are you gonna be okay finding him? But of course, but I don't want to if we don't have to. I can stay a Reaper if that's what he wants. I just need him to give us a hand here. <clears throat> but the HP regen pins scale with the number of party members. HP regen pins scale with the number of party members. I don't get it. Care to evaluate or explain? You got me a little bit confuzzled here, boy. Like, you know the pins that slowly heal you? No. I don't think I've used any of those. Sugumi, I hope she'll be okay. Shuka. Sure. Don't worry. It'll be a while. But I know someone who can fix her. She'll be back to normal soon. Just been stuck in there for so long inside Mr. Mio, of all places. Now looking back, not long before Shinjuku was destroyed, I saw this really gaudy Reaper lurking around. Gaudy? I get the feeling she has something to do with all of this. You sure that wasn't Coco from yesterday? I don't think so. Reaper wasn't so princessy. It was Coco three years ago, right, Beep? I don't know, dog. Well, I do. Kind of hard to forget someone who shot you. Huh? Maybe it was her then. I know you're worried about Tsugumi, but her soul's safe and sound. She'll be back to her old self before you know it. Friend will see to that, promise. So let's try to stay focused, okay? Yeah, gotta keep moving. Let's move. Good to see you. Light pins, yo. Our pins. The more party members you have, the more they heal. Which makes sense, because your total HP is based on the HP of your party members. Man, things got pretty dismal around here. Yeah, and whose fault is that? Now look at me, kid. I just give out missions, and if you complete them, I let you through. You're not gonna stop us. After hearing what you kids are capable of, fat chance. Just gonna give you the mission lay low, so listen up. Win a five reduction chain battle in this area. Come back, and we are done. That should be easy. Uh, not if they're all gonna be shit sticks like this. 
Yo, this is this is a bad idea, Yordi. You're doing absolutely bad ideas here. Yes. I don't use the healing bill, uh, the healing pins at all. Actually, holy shit! What the frick? Bird brains. Nice one, Rin dudes. I just put Regen on my outfits and use Vampire Aura pins for healing. Get rid of the stupid birds first. randomly grabbed. Are we sure we can still do this? Easy. You got nothing to worry about. It gotta be fair though, the amount of power that the noise keep getting is kinda insane. They just keep getting more HP and more. And I don't feel like we are getting any stronger. Not bad, dude. Sush, by the way, have you ever had, like, a reduction chain battle bug out on you? I went into a, a 10 plus chain, right? And it just kept going after 10. I was, at some point I was at 14 and they just fucked me over. I died. And I was like, Nani, why does... I'm pretty sure I was, like, at 10 reduction chain and they just keep kept going. 
Like, why? Leave me alone. Kamisama. Fucking entire train. Trem. Destroyed, yo. Okay, now we get to go into a gecko fight. That's actually that's something that I want to do ever again. Okay, now let's go look for the fucking gecko. Oh shit, okay, now I know, now I gotta use this. Didn't realize he was charging up. Also lost sight of the gecko, which is even worse. And there he is. Already out, Jesus Christ, man. Yo, why do these geckos always hurt so much? Oh, uh, this is really bad timing. Are you fucking kidding me? This is trash. This is absolute trash. Let's have a look. You are fine. You are fine. I'm not gonna deal with fucking elephants. This is fine. This one is fine as well. No geckos, no elephants. Those can fucking piss off. This will be easy. That I'm really sure about scorpions either, though. Hell yeah, I am! 
<laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh. Yaddy yaddy does he. Scorpions again. I think I'm just gonna blow these guys up. It's too many. Ugh. I don't remember what this one was. Was this birds? Oh, this was penguins. You guys were not necessarily terrible to fight. Just the big boy takes a long time to murder. Pretty 
Bird brains smashed. Go. One is bear and the other one is puffer fish. Don't make me laugh. As long as I keep an eye out on my HP and Dorge. Shouldn't really have an issue with the bears either. thing about the bears is that they just tend to counter very hard. Just saying how I need to pay attention to dodge their attacks. What does Yordi do? Face tank one. Easy. Turn up the volume, yo. Birds don't have too much HP, so do the puffer fish. Maybe the red one has a lot more, but we should be fine. Did you see that? I did, 
Okay, we're done. Finally, Jesus. Never, never fight on a Shibuya crossing. Jesus Christ, it's a lot of experience points. Shot in the tank. No. Oh, this is actually not too bad. It's a good one. Disco dive kick. Oh, he's instantly gonna max out, isn't he? Yeah. Mutate, sure. Killer princess. Oh. Strike your target with an aerial kick. Fully charged to launch the enemy into the air. You're done. What's this? Oh, sure. Guacamole shenanigans. You're done as well. Oh, that was L2. Guess I'm gonna put you to L1. Or I put both of you on L2. We'll see what I still need to level up. Can't put Uber pins with each other though. Righteous Rabbit. No, that one is done. It's an Uber. Uber, Uber. Electric Manicure. I thought this one was gonna evolve into that. The answer is no. Who's this? Marvelous Crash. Oh, that was weak. This one has an evolution. Okay. Well, did what he wanted. Yeah, okay. See, I knew you kids could do it. You're free to go ahead, although the only thing win for you is. Got another message. Susie K, did he move again? Yep. Looks like he's in front of Shibuya Stream. And if I recall, the realm beyond are off limits. Meaning we'll probably be facing off with them there. Let's hope not. Koyo Blaze. A bit Gourmand about town. Thanks for coming. Let's move. You think fun here? Oh, welcome back. Scarf. Thanks a bunch. Hurry back. More noise. It's is it too much to ask just to let us pass in peace? As life, yo, sometimes you just gotta fight your way through. Sometimes, life is only but fighting right through the walls. Wish this wasn't- this weren't one of those times. Alas, such is the nature of the game's final days. Look sharp, here they come. Let's see what kind of garbage they're gonna send my way this time. Frogs, frogs, and bears. Okay, that's not too bad. I'm just gonna go into blaze mode, I don't fucking care. Attack is still way too weak for this. Can't even kill all the frogs. <laughs> the 
Did he just get hit out of the air? That is so typical. Let's try again. killer beats in one fucking fight. No thanks. Kicked him right in the nuts. Crush a rush. Okay. Booyaka! Ain't no stopping us now. Don't know, things looking worse by the minute. Indeed. Although to us the city may appear just as chaotic as ever. In actuality it has been all but sapped of its spirit. We can't let this place end up like Shinjuku. Shibuya is not worthless, it deserves better. We do manage to stop Shiba. Will things really go back to normal? Hmm. Maybe. Not. Maybe not. Not right away, at least. But are you gonna let that stop you? No, of course not. Good, after all. Never know until you try. Things might even go better than you expected. Just gotta put your faith in that possibility and keep pushing forward. And isn't that what you've done always done? Even when things looked bleak, you kept going. You kept fighting because you hoped things would turn out better if you did. You couldn't see the better future, but you believed in one. That's what matters, I guess. As long as the city stays intact, it'll return to normal eventually. People Shibuya wouldn't have it any other way. Come on, better get moving. Okay, new R3. this uh are one of these shite ones this is also a shite one they're all fucking shite this one <sighs> well i guess we're starting with uh, the cocho void Press underway. God, serious? I'm so sick of these nasty noise! Low through, I am to admit I concur. So what, are you gonna just complain him away? Yes! Let's complain him away. Uh, you okay, Shoka? What? Obviously. Let's just get this over with. Oh shit. Elephants. Oh, fucking Christ on a stick. Okay, blow them all up. Oh, 
the wolf dead. Yeah, looks like it. The game is doing a good job with suddenly becoming a lot more challenging than it was before. Can't lose concentration. Otherwise, we end up dying. Bolt of the Beauty. Oh, we instantly finish one of those other ones. Super chill. Please tell me that's the last of him. Ain't many places for him to hide. What? Oh no, that better not be another selfie. Where the hell is this? It's still the same place. Looks like a river to me, yo. Must be the Shibuya River then. The mere mention of rivers calls to mind of the far fallen rivals. Oh, the deep river society, poor guys. Well, I can only hope they are resting in peace. Yeah, don't really want to deal with the Dead River Society. What the hell is he doing down by the water, yo? Good question. Guess we'll just have to head over and ask them ourselves. Okay, we got another L2 to put in. Or, you know, fix it with uh, one of the other ones. Because as far as I can tell, I don't really have any more L2 space. I guess we can go with an L1 instead. I'm among your biggest fans, beaming. Well. We're here. <laughs> yeah, my Reaper sense aren't exactly tingling. If he is hiding underwater, he's got to come up for air sometime. Hang on, look over there. It's open. Entrance to the river. Could Suzukichi have ventured upstream? Actually, I think he did. What? Let me see. Here. Well then, I just gotta go in after him. Rod's practically inviting us inside, yo. Before we do, though, I can use my powers to warp us down there. Okay, then in we go. Guess what time it is? Time for death? So that's kind of what it feels like. There was one slope, right? At Tower Records, but Tower Records was closed. What to do? It's three. I'm pretty sure I couldn't go to Tower Records from Shibuya. 
Maybe it opened up now. Chocolate. Is SQ having chocolate time? Whoa. <laughs> What's whoa? What are you woeing about? Whoa, you already. Listen, I've been getting my ass kicked the entire time so far, and I don't really want to deal with it. Oh, yeah, I can go inside now. Up time. Journey has been live for 11 hours and 10 minutes. Almost a 12-hour stream. Looks like one of the noise got her. Would be loath to leave her as she is. In that case, let's land a hand. Sounds right. good, Rindo? Sure, let's do it. Well then. She has an actual face though, Marino Bordihara. Uh, how can am I supposed to focus on studying when there's a new chapter of Elistra waiting for me? But if my grades drop any lower, I'm done for. Oh, this sounds like a terrible idea. Yordi doesn't want to do timed battles anymore. Leave it to me, yo! I saw that, Neku. You got knocked out of the air by something again. Christ. This one is ass difficult. Yeah, I think we've got this. Don't say that. SQ. Don't want to hear it. Take it away. Uh, uh, bring it. 
Seriously. <laughs> I'm already past halfway of my time and I haven't even like gone past the second one yet. I know that these kingly ones always have shit ton of health as well. You know what, fuck this. I'm just gonna throw my boomers on them. Hope that it's Makes a bit of a dent. I think it can get it back up to 200, 300 easily. Okay, that's at least something. It's horrible. Our party is equipped to win. Okay. Last wave, frogs. If it even is the last wave. Okay, grab it. I got 30 seconds left. I swear, if this is not the last one that I'm peed off, you can throw me in the trash. Then I wasted my uh, groove here. Fucked. I'm absolutely fucked here. Only three bears? Yeah, no, there's a Kecleo around here. Serious? Double serious? Okay, I'm gonna reset the difficulty. If you lose, you sleep. I lost. I'm not gonna sleep. Fuck. It's too early. No. I'm gonna set it to easy. I just wanna beat it. I'm done. <laughs> this shit. I know I'll probably get better items from it if I play it on higher difficulty, but... Fuck this shit, for reals. Oh! 
Oh, because you play on easier already on bronze, that is super dumb. Fuckers, we blow up. Let's wreck him. Right, Let's wreck him. Bad penguin, Arzilla would never. Yeah, I know, right? Arzilla would never. Bad penguins be bad. Next wave, we're gonna blow up everything and as quickly as possible. The stupid freaking, you know, who's what's. There's only one thing that needs to die in this wave instantly, and that's the stupid Cackley or wherever it is. I can't even see it, it's so frustrating. Yeah, 
range is so annoying as well. Where'd he go? There. Okay, is this done? Is this all of them? Or is there a fifth? Well, got nothing better to do. <laughs> Should have shut the fuck up when I had the chance. Which ones are real? Blow him up. <laughs> what are you laughing about, SQ? What's so funny? Eh? I even said it to fucking easy and this fucking shit's trolling me like it's nobody's business. finishes three hang on if I just imagine all these concepts of as hot guys oh whoa it's way easier to remember now I've got a whole narrative and favorite characters and everything Hold on. you okay Nagi a sergeant a sergeant appears in a new chapter oh spoilers always inflict the most painful wounds no worry she'll be fine I think anyway let's get moving again Most painful indeed. Bonus deck. A 10 evolutionary secret displays the condition required to make certain pins evolve. Okay. Don't you mean mutate? Fuck it anyways. There's also a piggy nearby. R2. Oh yeah, I was doing the stupid shit. Spectral Swords. Let the storm rage. Uh, you aren't done yet, but you, on the other hand, are done, Neku Boy. Yeah, sure, we'll give this garbage one to you. Is. Oh, it's you. Come again. Come again. Biggie. All right. What's a piece of fresh? Just be careful. That wasn't too hard. Oh wait, we're still on easy. Eh. 
I'm stunned. Let's go kick uh, whatever his name was, his face in. So not looking forward to having to fucking level up all these pins. How many pins do I have at this point of the total records? 209 of the 333. <sighs> at least we found all the shitties. Wait, are the plague noise not... Counted? Oh, the, uh, the plague noises are here. Oh, Leo Cantus Armo. Still got quite a few left to find chapters. Psychic Rank Reaper. Let's go. Let's have a look. Let's go, Sushikichi, you stink face! Let's move. Are we on the ground? This is the Shibuya River. Weird ass place for him hiding. But I don't see him anywhere. Come on, just give us a sign here, Big Sue. Big Sue. Is that that was me? Did you say that? Who cares? Just keep looking. Still no sign of him though. Certainly does not bode well. Set back for now. It's blocked, we can't get out. What the hell's going on? That bastard making us go even deeper? Even if we do go, won't get us anywhere. The river starts up near Cat Street and runs underground the whole way. There's no way out. You're saying Suzukichi tricked us again. Damn it. Why? Why? him. Just stay right there. Don't move. Not like we've got a choice. Give me that. Um. <gasps> there. Or did you? Told him to curl up in the ball and die. Yeah, Rindu, you didn't do your time trick yet, right? Right. Time trick? Yeah, he can turn back time. It's pretty sweet. Ah, so that's what he was talking about. Rindu, when you've used that power of yours, have you ever noticed any side effects? No, not really. It's good. There are these weird bird things that show up sometimes. Apparently there's some kind of noise. Bird noise. Minami Mode said something about their trash made from me turning back time. Well, do they do anything like attack you? No, they're just kind of there. It does seem like they're more. It does seem like they're more every time I see them. If anyone knows a thing or two about trash, it's Minimimoto. You might want to avoid using your powers if you can, just to be safe. Rindo. It reminds me, did you get another vision today? Yeah, I can see them too. To be honest, I couldn't really tell what was going on. But if we want to stop whatever it was from happening, we've got to find a way out of here, right? Even I'll try to find an exit. Just two of you? Yeah, we'll cover more ground that way. But make sure to keep in touch. 
If anything happens, we'll come running. Gotta stay safe. What were you and Neck talking about? We decided we're gonna split up and look for a way out. Okay, hey, look, I'm really sorry. For what? I thought we could trust Susukichi. Well, fool me once, fool me twice, I guess. I stitched him yesterday about what happened with Sugumi and Neku and all. And about how there's something weird with Shiba's power. He said he thought it was weird too, so he helps out. But then he went and did this. Is that why you were so angry at him? Ah, uh, sorry. I'm so useless. You're not useless. You help all the, all the time in battle and stuff. If anyone here is useless, it's me. Are you kidding me? You can literally go back in time. How is that useless? I don't know, it's just... I didn't seem too thrilled about my using my powers. But it's not up to him if I use them or not. It's up to me. Never mind, it's fine. It's not literally up to you either. <laughs> to be fair. River runs all the way through the subterranean tunnel, does it not? Yeah, last time we checked. Just uh, feared. In that case, it bodes quite ill. What do you mean? Shibuya is, after all, a valley. And the Shibuya River flows through said valley at its lowest point. So what you're saying is, if it really starts coming down, we're pretty much screwed, right? Oh shit. So what, a little rain isn't gonna kill us? Not like we can drown when we're already dead. Speak for yourself. We're technically not dead yet, and I prefer to keep it that way. Oh yeah. I would like to believe me we might be spared. That's chilly, but we cannot be sure such would be the case. Also, pardon the sun changed the subject, but does anyone else hear that? Hear what? Yeah, what is that? Huh? Yuzuki, again? Are you alright? You better not have died on me. Yeah, we're okay. That's a relief. I want you to... you getting messed... getting caught up in this mess. Are you blind? Shibuya is getting torn apart. What? This pretty is basically already in ruins. Oh, shit. <sighs> shit! That's what they're hearing. What was that? The hell's going up on there? On on there. Zaki, are you there? She's not reading my messages. This is bad. I'm gonna try to get some info out of him. He's kind of seen one checked out. Yo, Rindo, this ain't good. I made it out through the hole in the ceiling. It's all messed up out here. No way. What is this? Is that Shibuya? Yo! Explosions! Waves! It is, and that must be the sound of the city falling apart. Well, at least we can get... Oh, I can go back. You might want to avoid using your powers if you can, just to be safe. I don't have any other choice. Besides, my powers have already activated, so I might as well use them. Question is, how far did, should I go back? Just gotta make sure we don't get stuck on the ground this time. Shibuya stream, I have to go back and stop us from going into the Shibuya River. This must be right after we arrived Shibuya stream. Or tickling. If he's hiding underwater, he's gotta come up for air sometime. Hang on, look over there. <sighs> it's open. The entrance to the river. This is where he sends me another selfie. It's from Suzuki Chi. Well, he's hiding underwater, isn't he? It is, but we can't follow him. What? Why not? Because it's a trap. Once we go in, he's gonna see what's inside. Spoken like a true time traveler. Let's just wait outside for now. Something's gonna happen here in Shibuya. What exactly? I'm not sure. But if we go in there, the city might get destroyed. But ain't we gonna get destroyed too if we standing around here, yo? I don't know. All I know is Suzukichi's not in there. I've done everything I can think of. Just gotta hope things turn out better this time. Saint Autumn's Strike.
Avoid getting trapped in Shibuya River. Let's go eat some tacos. Taco, taco. Hola, señores! Hola, señores! Where is Lizzie when we need her to listen to the taco man? Fucking best pin. The one that I just got. Oh, there's Lizzie. Yeah, I love it so much. Cool, good to know. From the Shibuya River, now to chase down Suzukichi. Okay, now we just sit tight here. Normally we would have gone upstream, but we didn't make it in time, did we? Yeah, sorry, I know you said not to use my powers, but I didn't think there was any other way. No, you're right, no point fighting to save the city that's already been destroyed. Sometimes the future's just hard to avoid, even when you can't see it coming. You know, I had a few visions back in my day too, but I couldn't tell what they were or how they connected to it anything. And yet I couldn't stop any of them from happening. With your powers, though, we've got a good shot at ensuring a better future, I guess. Look at Jordi. You can't say that, Lizzie. You can't say that. Rude. Suzukichi, what do you say? Didn't go inside, did you? Meet me at the uh, express on the way. And I'll tell you where Shiba is. Express way it is, then, hey, it's raining. Looks like it. Huh. And here I thought this place couldn't get any creep here. Guess you thought wrong. Word. It's too quiet. Shit, don't feel right, yo. Yeah, this isn't Shibuya. It is not recognizable as the city we once knew. Did he say? Come on, let's find Susukichi. We'll make him tell us where Shiba is. And then we can end this game. But it makes me giggle and gives me joy. Probably stay at the underpass. Lizzie, do I need to repeat what I said, what Bobo said yesterday about saying it at your work with all the priests around? If it makes you giggle and gives you joy, you should say it there as well. Always said he liked it there. Can't imagine why. Let's go. Okay, sorry for bullying. Heh, <laughs> you found me. And faster than I expected too. You just know how to control the board. I'll give you that. Hope the rain didn't give you too much trouble. Thanks, Sue. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but now that you're here... Let's go for a round. I'd skate or die then, yo. Must have taken you a lifetime to perfect that thick skull of yours, bro. Not that long. I ain't starting skating until I was at least seven, yo. Let's make fun of you, dimwit. What? You trying to say that to my face, yo? <laughs> Just did. Anyway, I gotta warn you, Wicked Twisters. I've gained a tempo since you last saw me. And now that the legend is here, gotta get serious. Your move, Twisters. I like working here defines me or people act like they have me all figured out. Oh no, listen, working there doesn't defy you. I just say, you should be able to uh, say the weirdest shit whenever you want, even if it's at work. What the frick? I feel like he's gonna do some kind of explosion shit. Okay, I was right, he's gonna do some explosion kind of shit.
Oh, he's just gonna keep summoning them? That's very annoying. At least this guy is not as annoying as uh, Minamimoto was. Oh, height? Oh, oops. But think of all the groove. What groove? Oh. Spawns the burbs. Did we win? <clears throat> nah. No so worth the groove from that. So oh, he's still not done. What the fuck is he doing? Light pins make the game so easy. Why though? Do all light pins have vampire uh, drain? I mean, they make the game kind of easy, but it's not like they do a lot of damage. Come on, I want to get to my uh, thing. Give me my killer move, mate. Oh. 
Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. Jesus, how much defense does this motherfucker have? Or HP, whatever. What is he doing? What's happening? We're getting sucked in! Get your asses out of there! Is he gonna do it again? Shit's on the stick. Imagine Beats never slowed, showed up week one, and you had to fight this form. Lol. I mean, he never actually went, like, hard on us in week one, even with Minamimoto around, right? Actually got hit there. Fuck. That's a lot of damage. All of a sudden. Just uh, let my HP repair itself. After all, that's why I got all the regens on, right? Is he doing? Oh, fuck. I'm getting sick and tired of this shit stick. Welcome back. This is just annoying and takes long. Just gonna up the damage a little bit. Oh, Yordi, you fucking suck. Seriously? <sighs> he does so much damage as well, man. It's insane. In fact, oh, what? Here 
cargo is antlers. Could this be an opening? Let's let them have it while we got the chance, yo. Sushi, if you hadn't told me that, I wouldn't have still been here for another half hour to get it. Totally forgot the entire time. Well, Sorry. At least we survived. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you just like to see me suffer, don't you, Sush? You just like to see me suffer. Sorry, my ass. You shouldn't have pulled him. <sighs> Would have been here for another half hour. Shimmy is always so friggin' loud. But here, all the voices get drowned out. Kinda calms me down, you know? Can it? We won. You said you'd tell us where he is. So tell us, where's Shiba? Where's Stinky? Look at you, Shoka. Here with Neku, the living legend himself. And Rindo, leader of the Wicked Twisters. You discs form a more balanced edge than I thought. <laughs> Closing time. Bye, Yordi. Bye, Lizzie. Maybe I'll see you in a bit. I think I'm gonna see if I can beat the game, if the game ending is nearby, at least. He wasn't always like that. He used to be more human. Now he don't care what happens to any of us. Even if we get erased, like we don't even matter. Big Sue. Once he got his hands on those new powers of his, they turned him into a real poison disc. Now he thinks he's God tier. If you had that much of a problem with him, why did you keep following his orders? <laughs> That's what you do with leaders. You, you follow, follow them, you know. You know? The truth is, I thought I was strong enough, but I was wrong. Strong enough to what? Strong enough to take him down myself. But why? Passing judgment on Shibuya like he's trying to do. Just don't sit right with me. Me neither. Once he started spouting that nonsense, I wanted to sweep him <laughs> off the board with my own two hands. As a pro. Knock some sense into him, you know? You could have at least told me what you were up to. Why didn't you say anything? Because I didn't think I'd lose to you before I could make my move. <laughs> I guess I so we underestimated you, discs. And now it's up to you to take care of him. You know, part of me wonders if he's just lonely. He's always staring out at the crossing, waiting. You ought to find him somewhere around there. You tried to stick us underground to keep us safe, didn't you? Did I now? You know the Shibuya River's not just any river. <laughs> you really do know the city inside and out, don't you? That river's on its own plane. It's gotta be, seeing as it's still flowing from Shinjuku without a source. And if it survived one collapse, it ought to survive another. Might even let you escape the city altogether. If it came down to it. So I figured. Even if I couldn't beat Shiba. You discs could. You weren't trying to trick us. You were trying to protect us. It's all up to you now. You're Your move. Make, Make it count. It count. Poor guy. Looks like it's game over for me. Big Sue. He vanished. And here we thought he was pulling one over on us. Guess he fooled us again. But what about Shiba, though? Brother's lost two friends now. You really think he don't feel nothing, yo? Maybe he can't because of the dissonance. Might have destroyed his heart. Just like it destroyed Shinjuku. 
We can't let it destroy Shibuya, too. <laughs> well, now we know where he is. It's time to end this, once and for all. Beat son strongly like Waka. We've all got each other's backs. Shiba's got no one but himself. Huh? Jeez. But Waka was better. I mean, it's true. There's no way he can beat us. We got this. Still no response. That seriously, that is what takes me the most. That's what I want to know the most. Who the fuck is Swallow? Swallow. I'm not gonna make it at this rate. I've been comparing the data on Shinjuku and Shibuya's current state, but it still doesn't add up. Something must be missing. Big bro, hey! I knew this was rhyme. I knew it. And it still wasn't going okay. Is everyone safe? Did something happen? I respond, but who do you think it is? <sighs> I don't know, man. Like, am I supposed to know who Swallow is? Is Swallow, uh, does Joshua suddenly appear out of nowhere again with his big fat head and his swag all over the place? I don't know who Swallow, uh, Swallow is and I'm gonna figure it out tonight, probably. I have to go find out for myself, seeing as believing after all. Okay, so I knew that this was Rhyme at least. Oh, Suzukichi. Anything rash, my friend. About to make a real poisoned move. Hello. See Shibuya is in shambles. Oh, what is his name again? Ayano and Suzukichi have both been erased, and you've strayed from his scythe just like Shoka and Sugumi. You should reflect on yourself before speaking of others. Or do you plan to go after Shibuya falls? I'm unsure. I may choose to stay here rather than leave. You intend to go down with the city? My next destination is doomed to meet the same fate, why delay the inevitable, I see. What do you think it is that Shiba seeks? Shibuya offered us refugee in our time of need, yet he has forsaken his new shelter. And his efforts have left him entirely alone. I do not know what his ultimate goal is. Perhaps he intends to ascend to some sort of higher existence. I cannot begin to imagine. Neither can I. Not even after all these years. What is it? That is an excellent question. Where indeed? I would just- I would literally lull my ass off if Joshua and Mr. H just suddenly appear out of nowhere and be like, Hi! Hi! Another vision. Another vision. What the? This must be what's gonna happen today. <laughs> Joshua is just a big troll, like, I know he's, like, one big G. Shit. Shibuya's really gonna be destroyed. No. I won't let that happen. But, uh, I do miss Joshua's. Greetings, sheeple of Shibuya! Got some red-hot news for ya! The final day is finally upon us. Shibuya's day of reckoning has come! One more games in the series that explored the other planes. Yeah, I agree. Just listen to that sweet silence settling in over the city. The quiet before the firestorm, if you will. I'm just burning to get started today. But first, a round of applause for the wicked twisters. Angel shit, goddammit, yeah. The goal is just ahead. Now all that's left is for you to mosey on over here. Try not to get burned on your way. Cause once you get here, I'll bring the real heat. <laughs> and with that, Joshua is a fraud. I bid you adieu. Oh, that was... Joshua was a fraud in the game as well. <laughs> Sure is. 
angels had a game of their own. That would be fucking hilarious. <sighs> That's where people go when they're erased. Y'all ain't got much to say? I get it. You're nervous about the big fight. So am I. You sure don't look nervous. Just good at hiding it. You ain't scared. Yeah, I am. The only one who isn't on edge is you. Am too, yo. I'm nervous as hell. Okay, you definitely don't look nervous. I must agree. I bet you don't even know what the word nervous means. Hey, Zap, sleep well, my dude. <laughs> I was just playing. I know what nervous means, yo. But I ain't feeling too worried. So y'all can just leave it to me. Care to clarify worms for brains? Leave what to you? I am unsure even he knows. <laughs> sure is nice having a couple vets on our side, though. Don't you think? Grin, dude? Yeah. We've got to get to Shiba, no matter what. Not like he's gonna let us just waltz up to him, but still. On the upside, at least he's all alone now. Most of the Shinjuku Reapers are gone now. And the ones left aren't exactly his biggest fans. I bet they'd be willing to lend us a hand if we asked. Worth a try. We should take all the help we can get. Gonna need it if we want to save the city. Right. Let's go. Listen, I'm gonna be serious with y'all. I still hate the fucking mask that Rindu is wearing. Rindo, why the fuck are you wearing a mask? What the fuck is wrong with you? Should be asking the devs this though, instead of Rindo. It's not like he knows. Wow, even Beats Groove feels slow all of a sudden. Need something. 300k, Thirsty Frog. Trade, take 5, fills the pin gauge faster when not using Sykes for a prolonged period. Expensive pin day. Listen, this is not even the most expensive pin that I've seen. I've already seen a 500k pin. I got 10. Look another Uber pin. Multi pin. Tokyo Plaza. Mm. You're talking to none of your business. Is it a girl? Drop it. I ain't reading it anyway. Rude. You should at least see what they say. Nah, I'm good. Suit yourself. The whole thing is just whack, man. Don't even feel like Shibuya anymore. Yeah, I've never seen anything like this. Hard to believe I was hanging around here, like, just a couple of weeks ago. It's a completely different city. Now we know that that is Rhyme that's bothering him. Oh, you too. How goes? I was hanging twisters. Hey, you guys. To the rumors were true, you really are back phones. In the flash, and so long, I just thought you weren't gonna show up. You all don't look so hot. Aren't you sure you're up for this? Yeah, we'll be fine. It'd be a big help if you could take care of the noise in the RG, please. Sure. Not like we got anything better to do. We're a little short-handed at the moment. But I'll be busting my ass to make 
up for it, so you better be busting yours with uh, to win this game. Yes. We will. Hold you to it. Help me in too. Gonna fight for Shibuya till I kneel over. You almost <laughs> did, bro. You almost did. Twice. Now, just be sure to keep your guard up. That Shiba has one tough cookie. Oh. We know, thanks. Yeah, a fair amount of places in East Asia have awful smoke, so people have masks at the ready long before COVID. A lot of people incorporate them into their fashion since they are so common. I see. Still looks like Shiza though. Sush. Coco! Hold up, yo, ain't that? Coco! My, if it isn't the Wicked Twisters, am I ever glad I ran into you? I can wish you well in person, so good luck out there. Seriously, yo? What do you mean, good luck? Yo, has better be helping us raise that noise, yo. Oh, and like, why should I? We're kind of um, short, short on numbers here. We could use the help. Oh, but I am helping, dear Neku. Even if some uncouth oafs doubt my efforts, I'm doing what I can to ensure we all live happily ever after. So what exactly are you doing? Uh, can you, like, cool it with the third degree, sis? I've been erasing noise and helping folks I see around town. I'm, like, literally doing so much, okay? Guess we shouldn't have doubted you, perhaps. Yet something about her personality strikes me as deeply untrustworthy. Well, like, harsh much? I mean, let's be real. Anyways, regardless of what you might think, I'm like, totes committing to saving the city. So, are all your preparations in order? If you're having trouble with Shiba, Kaya might be able to help. Kaya, wait. Hmm, that's what I said. But what makes you think he can help us? Because he's like, knows a lot about the city and stuff. He can literally do whatever you want. Plus, it's like probs a good idea to check in with him before you do anything else. Maybe I'll have some intel for us. I haven't the faintest idea what he might know. But there's surely more than a fairy princess like me. Okay, we'll check in with Kai. Splendiferous! I believe he's somewhere in Udagawa at the moment. It's not too far. Let me try messaging him. He's not responding. Maybe he's busy chatting with someone else. He can only really handle one conversation at a time. Think we should just pay him a visit to instead? Might as well. Shouldn't take too long to get there. Well then, I do believe this is where we part ways. Best of luck. To you all or whatever. <laughs> Thanks, fucking Coco. Coco is such a... I'm not gonna say it. I don't know what I should think of Coco. Coco is like beyond help, beyond redemption at this point. If she'd get hit by a brick on her head and die at this moment, I don't think anyone would really be bothered by it. It's a little bit extreme, isn't that, Yordi? Oh, what? Nah, fine. I have conflicting thoughts when it comes to Coco. Always kind of conflicting thoughts with Coco. Hey, is that Hishima? Uh, hey. Well, met Wicked Twisters. Hey, so might be a little late to ask this, but whose side are you on? Rather late indeed. Were I pressed to choose between Shinjuku and Shibuya, I would abstain. My actions are not guided by my allegiance to any particular city. Well, what actions are you taking now? I'm searching for someone. Okay, who? That is none of your concern. You should focus your time and energy on the task before you. I wish you well. This guy gives zero shit. He's a Shinjuku Reaper, right? Yeah. He used to be Shiba's right-hand man, even though it sounds like they didn't get along very well. Yeah, Ishima always kept himself watching from afar. Or the Bo... Bo or Shiba never really chased after him. Just let him be. As far as I could tell, at least. What do you suppose Ishima might be searching for then? Maybe Shiba, I guess. But if that's the case, then he should tag along with us, right? Anyway, like he said, we don't have time to waste worrying about it. 
we have to hurry. You know what I kind of like? The fact that Kubo, that dipshit, got such a short end when he got killed. He just got murdered by Media. Um, I don't. I can't even pronounce his fucking name. By uh, our uh, math man. Kai. Shoka, I'm so relieved to see you're okay. You too. Hey, if you're not doing anything, do you think you could help us out? But I am doing something. I am waiting a certain someone who. One who holds incredible power. Power not of the supernatural variety. Weird. I believe they may be able to offer some assistance. And if were we are to save the city, we will need all the help we can find. That said, I worry they might be unable to arrive at the rendezvous point if I do manage to meet them. And if they are willing to assist, then I will gladly aid you in your efforts. Thanks a bunch. You are on your way to do battle with Shiba, correct? Yeah, that's the plan. Can you tell us anything about Shiba's power? I would if I could, forgive me. I'll continue to analyze what data I can find. If I come upon any new revelations, you will know right away. Thanks, appreciate it. Are you two done or? We are. Take care and be well, Shoka. And tell Rindo I would be more than happy to perform any divinations he requires. <laughs> yeah, I'll let him know. See you around then. Let who know what? Let you know to give Kai a call if he wants another reading. That's good. Hey, um, are you too close? Why? No reason, just curious. I mean, we work together, you know, doing Reaper stuff. Sometimes I'd have him tell my fortune. Does that satisfy your curiosity? Yep, total. Anyway, you can trust him, he's a good guy. Okay, good to know. Let me guess, he's meeting with freaking uh, Rhyme right now. Trying at least. Shoulder little by little, I feel a bit better. <laughs> On my side. Hesitation. To realize. Just to realize. Yeah. So, well, here we are, back at the crossing. No turning back now. And I ain't going down without fight, yo. Such would be an unthinkable end to our tale. Rindo. She was tough, but we can beat him. Right, Rindo? Yeah. Yeah, we've got this. Shibuya's counting on us. Right, let's go. He's just standing here in the middle. Well, look who it is. My favorite sheeple. Sheba! I moved all my things here. Thought I could use the extra space. How kind of you to pay me a housewarming visit. I do hope you find it to your liking. Come in, sit down. Make yourselves comfortable. Enjoy it while you can. Look at you twisters. Totally Shiba total, totally not wearing a shirt, just just a jacket, like. And finally, Rindo Kanade. You really surprised me, I must say. How so? The game had grown so boring till you came and fired things up. You beat the unbeatable ruin bringers, recruited one of my own reapers, enlisted the aid of the one and only Neku, and made it all the way here in hopes of defeating me like moths to a flame. You might be acting all cocky now, yo, but you know you ain't stand a chance against us. Yeah, and we're not here for your entertainment. We just want to end this stupid game and get the hell out of here! Is that right? Then I'm sorry to disappoint you. You can struggle all you want, but there's no happy ending awaiting you. 
No, we must prevail for the sake of Alestra. Better focus on one game at a time. Gotta finish this one first. Yeah. Whatever you do, just don't let your guard down. No telling what he's gonna pull with the power of dissonance on his side. Dissonance, you say? Now where in the world did you hear about that? Does it matter? <laughs> no, it doesn't. All that matters is that you're here now. I've been burning to finally meet you, Neku. Ooh. The most famous player in all of Shibuya is within my reach at last. If I can snuff you out here and now, there'll be no one left who can stop me. I can pass judgment on Shibuya without any impediment. <laughs> I scoured the city for you, you know. Even tried to lure you in from the RG with those silly pins. What? That's what you were using these pins for? To find Neku? <laughs> yes, ironic. Seeing as he was hiding under my nose this whole time. But my efforts weren't completely wasted. I managed to snag you all instead. Not exactly what I was hoping for, but you weren't without your own merits. Uh, what's happening to him? He's unleashing his true power. As thanks for getting me so fired up. I'll make your immolation an immaculate one. Listen, Shiba is Shinjuku's most powerful reaper. Ease up even for a second, and we're finished. Good to know. Help us. No biggie. We just gotta win, yo. Come on. We're ready for you, hotshot. Bring it on. Rindo, don't use your powers unless you absolutely have to. Uh, okay. If they really are connected to the dissonance somehow, there's no telling what consequences they'll have. Right. We keep moving, even if things don't go according to plan. It's tough, but it's for the best. Got it. Let's go. It's tough, but it's for the best. Okay, let's see how bad this is gonna go. I'm definitely not with my best abilities, and... Well, okay. It looks like we're... Back in Final Fantasy VII Remake, uh, guys. Oh god, did he just turn into butterflies? Long have I waited this moment. The mere thought of crushing you has got me all fired up. Well, it's time to cool off, because we're ending this game. Pretty sure this is a multi phase fight again, just like. Holy shit, that hurt. I'm not going to be able to land a single hit. To get third groove up. No. I like that. Just doing my job. I've got you now. 
Sure, your knee's still getting hit by garbage like that. Guy is just standing and flipped. I don't like this guy's evasive shizer. Tank that a little bit too hard. That's phase one. <laughs> Bullshit. Don't trick us like that game. What the fuck? Huh? Where are we? Well, we beat Shiba, which could mean this is the RG. We really made it back? Nope. Oh, fake, bro. All fake. Get ready. What's wrong with everyone? 
Don't know. But I sure hope we don't have to fight them all. Indeed. We're woefully outnumbered. Yeah, but these are the weak ones, guys. No worries. Oh, how I miss the weak ones. <laughs> oh, oops, that was not what I wanted to see. Trick. This is also a trick. Sort of. <sighs> there is the motherfucker again. You enjoyed yourselves. If so, you'll be pleased to know the real fun is about to begin. I've just about had it with you, yo. I'll be sure to make your final moments truly heartwarming. You're going down in flames! Are you still on with... Okay, I was gonna say you still own the same shit. Yo, I don't find I don't like the Shiba. Shiba is a bitch to fight. I don't like him at all. comes again with the doubles. Shit. Come on, you already pay a little bit more attention. Oh, no, that really sucks.
Couldn't dodge that. A nice one. Oh, what the frick? Sucks. I'm gonna not win this. <sighs> ah, fuck! Shiva has absolute garbage balls. Bad design. I really don't like him. Doesn't fit. It might be that or the fact that most of the pins in this game are just absolute trash. Like, the frustrating part about this is, is that most of my charge attacks just don't hit. Those chains are absolutely useless, because he's in the air the entire time. The shotgun attack does not reach very high. And getting close on him is also not very worth it, because he just keeps moving away with his fucking Teletubby flower thingies. Tell it to be flower thing, sure, Yordi. Those things are called butterflies. <clears throat> because literally almost nothing affects him, you can't get your groove up either. It's absolutely disgusting. sucks. Oh, that's really trash. Really trash and bad. Okay, we're gonna completely change everything. Uh, can I remove, not sell all? You are useless. I want you to be something more useful. 1300 darkness. Let's confuse the enemy, killing blow. Wish there was a better way for me to, like. Strength, new, brand, level, psych. Okay, this is absolute trash. Slow, don't like these. 
Rappy Tap, Avid Slap, Heavy Slam, it's uh, Triangles already. Six hundred. Not useful because he's in the air the entire time. Um, so if I'd had to guess, our best bet would probably be this one. Where's my other high one? I know I had another one that did decent damage. God damn it. Useless. It's also useless. Rep tap square. Lunge it is on triangle. You listen, I don't care. Give me a square game. I know I can have multiples, right? Should be able to handle multiple squares. Apparently not. Scheiße. <sighs> Healing hour of light. Slowly. one. You're useless, so we're gonna swap you around for something better. That's not gonna work either. Rockets? No. no. Boomerangs might work, though. Aerial Assault. one. Shotgun. I need more air time. This one doesn't do it. This one will work. Keeps attacking as long as the button remains pressed. Kinesis, useless Kinesis. Let's see what else we have. Need something with as much aerial as I can have. This one is not going to do it. Be worth using the bombs. Vampire HP. Do it two times. The rockets are useless. I think I'll go with Topodian Dignus for more. What can I get if I put you on square? Put something good on square at least. 
No bombs, it's useless. Lightning. Circuit break. Is there another light that I can use on square? None. Light. That's already being used. Vampire growth. Kinesis. Yo, let's do that. Regen double. I do not need points here. Rapid reboot makes pin reboot slightly faster. When facing a single enemy, yep. It seems like a good one. The irritation of enemies being poisoned or shocked. That's not useful to me at all. No mercy. PP boosts useless. the erasure okay let's try this again starting all the way up here again super annoying much better and now I can at least get my burst up as well Bye-bye. 
Much better. Jesus. Hundred percent, which is super chill. Okay, three hundred percent, nice. At least now, if we need to get HP back completely, we can do it. Threat muted. Skip this. Huh? Where are we? Well, we beat Shiba, which could mean this is the RG. We really made it back? No, mate. Sorry to disappoint. I can take much more of this. Yeah. Me neither. Damn. What are we supposed to do? Shiba. Have you enjoyed Round three. Yourselves? 
If so, you'll be pleased to know the real fun is about to begin. I just about had it with you, yo. I'll be sure to make your final moments truly heartwarming. You're going down in flames! Okay, so his double gangers so take damage, so bombs are very useful actually. comes that uh, attack wave. All those poses though, man, like... Okay, much better. What is he doing with his face in the ground? Keep your eyes on me. 
comes the boomy zoomies again. I know this is pretty much DM mode, and I probably should not try and attack him, but... Can, cannot not do that. Yeah, nailed it. Actually thought I was gonna lose that. Got him. Phase three. I doubt that's it though. Threat muted. Yeah, that's what we thought. Okay, finally, we did it. Stay gold. How could this happen? All my plans. Up in flames. But I was the chosen one. How could I lose to the likes of you? We did it. We actually did it. <laughs> wow. We beat the boss. Serves you right for underguessing us, brother. It's game over for you. <sighs> like you said before, we've got to declare a winner. And if you won't say it, then allow me. We win. No. No. But I'm the executor. Executor? <laughs> Shiva was a dumb fight. I didn't like Shiva at all. He's gone. I can't believe we actually won. Well, believe it. Now you can find Media. Oh, oh, my didn't pronounce his name was worse. Was also annoying because he kept teleporting. It was hard to hit. Well, what about you, Shoka? Are you going back to being a Reaper or are you coming to the RG too? <sighs> Don't know. Either's fine by me. Well, where do you think you'd end up in the RG? Beats me now that Shinjuku's gone. Maybe I'll wind up in some fancy ass house. Part of some picture perfect family. Or maybe not. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> Look, Rindo. The truth is. Good work out there, kids! <laughs> oh, he's still alive. No. You! I just hate teleporting and invulnerability. It's just so dumb. Who? Kubo. Like I always say, you gotta expect the unexpected. the unexpected. Be prepared for a future you didn't see coming. And that future arrives 44 minutes and 44 seconds past 4 p.m. <laughs> and now, it's showtime. What's showtime? <laughs> That's his power. Devour it all. The barrier. The rapist. The players. Everything. This whole. 
What's up with these birds, yo? Uh, it's you. The dissonance is coming from you. <laughs> nice detective work there, you little punk. Okay, plot twist. The whole city. It's getting erased. Appreciate the help, kid. I really owe you one. I never helped you. Sure you did, every single time you turned back the clock. Couldn't have made all this noise without you. And since Shiva screwed the pooch so badly... I gotta put my backup plan into action. You're not just a Reaper, are you? Oh no! I'm the Executor. What? Twist, kid! Believe it or not, I'm an angel from a much higher plane than this here, Yuchi. And yours truly has been tasked with executing the inversion! Okay, so he's an angel? What are you talking about? In other words, I nudge a few game pieces in the right direction, and lead the city towards its inevitable destruction. <laughs> So it was all you. The dissonance, my powers, everything. Nah, you get it. Brought you into the underground too. You're welcome for that. We angels ain't allowed to interfere with the planes ourselves, you see. So we got to appoint someone else to do the dirty work for us. You really are the literal worst. So what? You're saying you use Shiba so you could destroy Shinjuku too? <laughs> <laughs> what? You think going back in time will save the city? Well, I hate to break it to you, kid, but as long as you've got that pin, my noise are inevitable! <laughs> Break it, break it, break it, break the pin. Break the pin. You might have noticed, but I'll spell it out for you just in case. Use your powers again and you'll spawn even more noise. And I it just so happened to be the noise master. <laughs> break the pin. I can make him do whatever I want, whatever it takes to get the job done. And there ain't a damn thing you can do about it. Break the pin. Break the pin. Do? I guess Niku was right. About my powers. I shouldn't have used them so much. But if I don't use them now, then... Break the Shoka! pin. Break the pin. Break the pin. Break the pin. Break the pin. I have to go back. If I don't try to stop this, everything will be erased. I have to go back! 
idiot. You should have broke it. Broke it. Friendship points times three. SBY chapter end. The last day. It's no use. She be as good as destroyed if I don't do something. Break the pin. The vision again. It's that vision again. Close what to the end, are we? I can't let things turn out this way. The whole city. It's getting erased. I have to save Shibuya, no matter what. Greetings, sheeple of Shibuya. Got some red hot news for you. The final day is finally upon us. As long as we don't have to refight him. Okay. I managed to turn back time. Now I've got to tell everyone what's going on. How Kubo was the one plotting Shibuya's erasure. How he ripped us from the RG while we were still alive. How he gave me and Shiba our powers to help create all that dissonance. How he's the so-called executor. We'll find a way to deal with Shiba, but Kubo's gotta go. Him. And those rings of his. Well, this is it. You ready? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah. I feel bad. Uh, as do I. Uh. Oh, this is awkward. <laughs> Damn. Y'all ain't got much to say. Rindo. Did you turn back time again? Wait. Don't tell me something horrible and catastrophic happened. It did, but I also learned something pretty important as a result. I finally know who's been creating all that dissonance we've experienced. You do? Well, don't just leave us hanging. Spit it out already. It's Kubo, the Reaper. He's the one. He's the executor trying to erase Shibuya. Gramps? You mean his scraggly ass ain't dead yet? The Arbiter of Death remains alive. For now, that just means it's up to us to erase him. So if this is a game, does that make him the last boss? Maybe. Guess I was right about there being someone else pulling the strings. Guess so. Even though I don't know who Kubo is. Wait, you don't? Oh, right. You haven't had the pleasure yet. How would you describe him, quickly? An old asshole. I certainly cannot argue. We ought to tell Shiba. That Kubo's an old asshole? More specifically, that Kubo's the one behind all of this. There's no way we can take on the two of them, which is why we need Shiba on our side. Even if we cannot forge an alliance, perhaps he will agree to some sort of truce. Let's just hope he's willing to hear us out. First, we've got to go talk to Shiba. Hopefully we can get through to him. Shave Shibuya from Erasure. We're going again. Oh boy. That was seriously tough fight. I'd like to avoid the rematch if we can. Notice, but I'll spell it out for you in case. If you use your powers again, there will be even more noise next time. Stronger than before? We can't. Before it's a waste energy fighting Shiba. Greetings. Look who it is. My favorite Sheeple. Here goes nothing. Shiva, we need mm -hmm. to talk. Do we now? 
And what does it mean to talk about stopping the game and play? There's someone else we need to deal with, someone bigger than you. We need to save our strength so we don't have to fight here. <laughs> Thought you might spoof some sort of nonsense. I am afraid I don't follow. Who exactly is this someone else you desperately see? One of your Reapers, actually. Kubo. He's pulling all the strings, Kubo. No, because I've seen what he does to the city. What? From the future. Already fought you once and won. But after that, Kubo still destroyed Shibuya. He's using you, Shiba, and using both of us. Let's back up a bit. You fought me and won. You expect me to believe that? Hm. As if I could be so incompetent. Say our little conversation has burned out when you agree. If you're telling the truth, then all I have to do is change the future a bit. Who does this of no concern to me? What matters is what I get what I want. I want to destroy you. Or Shibuya along with you. God, we just have to wind up fighting again. The very thought of losing to you makes my blood boil. So I'll turn the heat up full blast this time. It's not going how I hoped it would. Get some kind of plan here? Yeah. Try something else. <laughs> Running away? Come back when you're ready to bring the heat. There's no way he'll listen to me, but maybe he will listen to someone else. Shinjuku's reverse? Like Shoka, okay, that may not be the best idea. Kae or Hishami. He's supposed to be on bad terms with Shiba, so he's out, which leaves Kae. <sighs> I wonder if he's up to it. Only one way to find out. We should be able to find him in Udagawa. We'll change our fate. I really need to shave again. I hate shaving. I'm so bad at shaving. There's always hair left. Getting distracted. Should be around here somewhere. Hopefully we know of a way to stop Shiba. Kai! Should come relief to see you. Okay, you too. If you're not doing anything, you think you could help us? I Oh, but I am doing something. I'm waiting to certain someone. Um. Kai. Listen, we need your help. Can I assist? Are you in need of reading? Not exactly. We need to talk to Shiba. We can't afford to fight him right now, and we need him to understand that. I know who's really behind the plot of destroying Shiba, it's Kubo. He said something about being an angel and the, and the executioner. It's just one of Kubo's pawns, we need him to understand that. So it truly is Kubo, I had my suspicions. After all, I was aware of his continued poor in Shibuya. An analysis of his soul told me as much. You analyze his soul? What's he saying? The realm of data and spirituality are remarkably similar at first glance. As it happens, a soul can be forced in much the same way as data. Unfortunately, this is the only true to a certain extent. I've dedicated years to finding and testing the limits of studies of the souls. Uh -huh. He was curious of a case from the start. It was a curious case from the start. He possessed very little existential data that I could find. I have been meaning to study him in more depth for some time. So what you've told me, illuminating, is illuminating to say the least. He truly is an angel or an execu ex executor that would make him from a higher plane than can be known to us. I'm afraid I would need much more time than we further have to further on us. It's fine. What about Shiba? Can you help us out with him? I can only think of one Reaper who could persuade him to alter his action, Hishima. What? How could Hishima help? By finding Shiba or something? No, of course not. Those two were once close of friends. Serious? Yes, but their relationship saw a sword after Shiba contained his new power. It seemed that Hishima has been keeping his distance ever since. I highly doubt he has abandoned all his feelings he once held for his friend. Literally just saw him over at Tipsy Toe's home. Be warned, Hishima will not be easily convinced. I'm uncertain if he will agree oh. to help you. Just have to give it a shot. 
Tipsy Toes Hall, then. He wandered off somewhere after we saw him. Yo, Kit Kat, can you drop... Uh, I'm a lane? Doubt that will work. Hishima is in the habit of checking his messages. Are your presence traversing through time or are you not? Yeah, I can make another stop to go back to when you run into him. Some you go run dude. Better luck, you should be able to change what happens next. Although if you do, that means we won't come here and have this conversation. I wonder what will happen to us. The us here now, that is. The soul is merely a container full of energy. Expect that energy will be collected and stored elsewhere. Mm. That sounds a lot like what Kubo said. We stop existing in one timeline. Our old energy feeds the noise. No use worrying about it now, I guess. I have to get back to when we talk to Ishima. Sure hope he can help. We're going again. Okay, we're back in front of Tipsy Toes Hall on our way to Udagawa. This is when we run into Hishima. Time to convince him to s time to convince him to convince Shiba to pause the game. Is that Hishima? Uh, hey, well met, Wicked Twisters. You have a minute. There's something I want to talk to you about. What might that be, Rindo? What are you doing? I need to ask you for a favor. Run away to confront Shiba, logically, considering this is the final day. But we can't fortify him, because now we know who's really trying to destroy Shibuya. Kubo, I presume. Huh? How did you? Yes. So I was right. After eliminating the impossible, he was the only one remaining. Though he never did leave enough evidence to make a final determination. Okay, so can you talk to Shiba for us? We need him to put a game on hold so we can take care of Kubo. It can't be done. Well, didn't even have to think about it. You won't even try. I'm sure you are aware Shiba and I are on, are on exponentially bad terms. My presence would only serve to provoke him further. Yeah. Ishima is like the worst person for the job. I don't think so, seeing as they were best friends before all this. What? That was ages ago. I have no bearing on the present. I'm afraid you'll have to find someone else to help you. And I do hope it goes well for you, genuinely. Hate to see Shibuya go up in flames. So much for that, indeed. His unwillingness to assist is both clear and absolute. Damn, how are we supposed to change Shiba's mind now? There must be someone else. Someone who knows something that can help. So where should I go next? There's gotta be something we can do somewhere. Let me think this through. We'll change our fate! <sighs> okay, I'm back at Tokyo Plaza. Did something important happen at this point? Something that could change the future? Didn't turn into anyone around here, did we? Maybe there's something I can do, but what? Hmm? Who are you talking to? None of your business. So, girl, drop a dite. Ain't reading it anyway. Roots, you should at least see what they said. Nah, I'm good. And yeah, this part, I almost forgot about it. Wait a minute. This be talking to, or not talking to, I guess, one of the Shibuya Reapers. If it is, it's nice for, to get them to help from them. Beat. Hey, beat. Are you messaging one of the Reapers? No, man. No Reaper. It's my little sister. You have a sister? Who... One who currently resides in the underground, no less? Oh, dang, you're right. Uh, so that must mean she's... She ain't dead. She ain't in the OG either. How can you talk to each other? How... How does she even remember you? Dunno, but she's been in the UG before with me when I was first playing my game. First game. After that, when Shinjuku got wiped out, can't explain it, but we just knew. So maybe she just knows something up this time too. Huh? Doesn't explain how she can't contact you. She did some weird hacker shit, don't ask me, yo. You have a hacker sister? Yeah, and she 
And now she keeps sending me shit. The story cast of colorful characters continues to its expansion. At least she can keep in touch with her from here. So is hacking her thing now? Guess so. She good at it anyway. Got all kinds of help from her up till now. But that's gotta stop. I wanna keep her out of this mess, you know? She's safe and sound in the RG. We should try to keep it that way. Word. We the one stuck in the UG, so it's up to us to take care of things. Yeah, it is up to us. We can't give up so easily. Let's have a look. We're going again. <sighs> Tower Records, what happened here again? Oh, we met with that what's her face, Coco. Maybe we can get info for from her. Coco! It isn't my wicked twisters. If I've ever so glad to run into you, I can wish you well in person, so good luck out there. Um, hey Coco, what is it, Rin Rin? You look like you have something important to say. Things I'm actually here from the future. OMG. And I know I was pulling the strings and trying to destroy Shibuya. It's Kubo. You mean that musty, dusty, crusty old Triton? That's him. Anyway, we need to save our strength to fight him. And to do that, we have to convince Shiba to... Is that so? Best of luck, then. They're all very important business to intend to, so I'll do mine and you do yours, Ryan's. You know, Shiba is the most agreeable fellow. Tell me about it. But I shall. He isn't the sort who can be convinced of anything. Not without putting up a fight. You may find it easier to just take him out, along with Kubo. Maybe yeah, I just thought to at least try to talk to him. Well, if you think it's worth a try, then far be it from me to stop you. Oh dear, would you look at the time? I'd best be off. Off where? Off to do my part to save Shibuya, dimwit. So make sure you do yours too. Right. That was awfully less helpful. We'll change our fate. This seems like hitting against a wall. Back on Cat Street. There's... This is where we talk to Kiria and Uzuki. Might be worth asking them if they can help somehow. How goes? As hang twisters, hey you guys. So the rumors were true, really are back phones in the flesh. So long, I almost thought you weren't gonna show up. Y'all don't look so hot, are you sure you're up to this? We are fine, but we know who's really behind the plot to destroy Shibuya. Oh, it's Kubo. Kubo? Thought he was out of the picture. Fortunately not, he's still around, and it's because of him that I can go back in time. Well, fancy that. Must be from a higher plane, then. Figures, everyone from up there is some kind of weirdo. He fits right in, let me tell you. So I can't say I'm surprised. Mm. Huh? So you're paying us a visit from the future, huh? Which means you've already failed once. Yeah, Kubo was just using me, Shiba, too. Even the Game Master? Yeah, which is why we need to avoid fighting him and focus on a real enemy. Kubo's got a whole army of noise, and we need to be at full strength if we want to stand a chance. And we better off with Shiba on our side. Is there anything you can do to help? Anything like what exactly? You want us to fight him or something? Rare of you to throw out such a half-baked suggestion. Oh, so you have a better idea? Maybe, I mean, obviously the best course of action would be to get Shiba on your side. Fat chance of that happening, so you'll have to settle for the next best thing. Have you tried getting him to call off the fight? Well, we tried enlisting someone's help, but someone as in... Who, the fortune teller guy? Actually, it's Hishima. Shima, you thought that flake would do you a favor like that? Hang on, Rindo. Ishima and Shiba can't stand each other. Not now, but according to Kaie, they used to be friends. Ooh, seriously? Gets her every time. Yeah, which is why we need his help, we asked him, but he refused. Now that you mention it, I did hear he was the number two guy back in Shinjuku. Must have been real close to Shiba, real partners in crime. Kaya said if we want to win Shiba over, Hishima's our best shot. If that asshole... things go south, 
with your partner and then that's it? You just act like you don't care anymore? Hmm. Who are you calling? Come on, pick up, you coward. Hello? Yeah, it's Uzuki. I'm speaking to Hishima Sakazuki. What? Oh-ho. Stop being so pig-headed. He was your friend, right? Get in there and sort him out. You're the only one who can and you know it. Huh? Don't play dumb. I know you know what I'm talking about. Rindo, didn't you say talk to him? Yeah, but I sort of went back in time after that to get here, so I haven't technically talked to him yet. Ah! Why can't you just do things in order that makes sense? Sorry. Alright, listen up. The Wicked Twisters are on their way to pay you a visit, and they're gonna ask you for a favor, and they need you to get Shiba to put a pause on the game. Kubo's using him, you know? You gonna sit back and let him happen to... let that happen to your partner, to your friend? If it were me, I wouldn't be able to bear it. So what it will be? Gonna step up and help your friend, or act like you're n like it's not your problem? Up to you. Um. Well, what are you waiting for? Get your ass over to where Hishima is. He should be a little bit more wis willing to listen than last time. Okay, Rindo, Neku, all of you. We ain't even worth naming. Go save Shibuya. We oh, will. Thank you. So what did Tishima say? That it would be irresponsible to leave things as they are. I'm long enough to realize that. Can you imagine? You played like that? And not having everyone just ban you just like nothing? That's being too much. Yeah, bet it would. Wake up for us to realize. Hey, is that Nishima? Hey, I'm not exactly certain what you're here to talk about. What I am certain of is that you, Rindo, know far more than you should. I've seen a lot. The parts of Time Traveler, presumably, yeah. Uh, please, we need you to talk to Shiba. You guys are friends, right? Or at least you used to be. What happened to make yes. you so... Pets diverged at all? What's that supposed to mean? It means that he changed, and I declined to change with him. You had just become a Reaper at the time, so perhaps you do not remember. Once he obtained his strange new powers, he was different. I had intent to walk over him from far as friend of my doom, but I saw, soon found out it wasn't worth the effort. I concerned myself with Shiba no longer. Huh? Huh? So you just stopped caring? At any rate, I need doubt I will be able to convince him of anything, but seeing as the situation is rather dire from all perspectives, I find myself willing to humor you. So you'll help us? Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. Domo arigato, Mr. Roboto. Oh my god, it's Jordi Scream. Look who it is, my favorite sheeple. Listen, we need to talk. Oh, I can't imagine what about... Kid asks you to listen, Ishima. And to what do I owe the pleasure, old friend? Those impressive new powers of yours. What about them? Around the time you, you acquired them several years ago, you also made contact with a certain something or someone, as it were. All the while completely nascent of their true nature. Which would be one far different from the deity you once revered them as. You fell at the feet of an idol like an utter fool. A saving. And I thought she wouldn't pull any punches. Are you here to enlighten me or just to get me hot under the collar? The former. The latter is merely a bonus. I'm speaking of the man who flattered you with you into fancying yourself the executor. Your subordinate Tanzo Kubo. Kubo? You're blindly a psycho fancy. By, this, by Psycho Fancy? Why he pulled the wool over your eyes and let you by the nose. <laughs> Kubo gave me these powers, but why? To help him erase Sinjuku. And now he's set his sights on Shibuya. Come to your senses, Shiba. Any longer and I won't be able to withhold my laughter. It's no expert or nothing. 
I don't know if this guy is taking the right approach here, yo. Well, who else did you have in mind? Huh. That's quite an, the allegation. Do you have any proof? Why should I believe a word you're saying? You didn't say anything of it. Kubo did in the future. And then I came back here to tell you, using the power he gave me. So you've already done this before. What we're asking is that you agree to call the truce for now. Just give us a little time and you'll see. If nothing happens, then we'll battle you for Shibuya, just like you wanted. Huh. I could be amenable to those terms. Very well. We'll put this little game on pause for the time being. But the clock's ticking, and once the time runs out, playtime will resume. It's fine, as long as you'll wait. So, Neku, are we good right. to go now? As good as we can be, given the circumstances. One way to find out if it's enough, right? Up past this bedtime, very much so, Lizzie. I kind of want to see if I can finish the game tonight. A little longer. Now to change our fate once and for all. Bulk healer. To button slowly restore your team's HP. Twenty-four hour stream. No, we are on thirteen hours though, but not twenty-four hours. Should buy us some time. Maybe we can maybe change our future. Good. Everything's in place. It's almost twenty-four. Just nine more hours to go. We're gonna save the city for sure. Any minute now. Not but to wait. Ain't no telling what's gonna happen, yo. Brace yourselves. Hmm. <laughs> well, well, you kids are on your best behavior, I see. Barely five for me. Get yeah. ready, eh, Rindo? And look at you, Shiva. Listening to your new master. I always appreciated your obedience. Made things real easy for me. We're about to make them quite difficult. Oh, it's too late for that. You was already lost. Your fate was sealed the second this pipsqueak turned back time. You see. That noise is born from temporal distortion. Distortion created when you turn a what-if hypothetical into will-be history. And all the cognitive energy from the would-have-been history gets replaced with a brand new set of thoughts. <laughs> but you see, now that old cognitive energy's got nowhere to go. It's just waste. Waste that multiplies every single time you turn back the clock! <laughs> if you thought that noise gave you a good beating the last time around, just wait till you see it now. You kids are in for a whole world of hurt. I ain't hearing all that noise. Only one who's in for a world of hurt is you. Yeah, Gramps. What he said. Meh. Talk is cheap. The fated hour is fast approaching. Come on, Rindo. Let's do this. There's no way I'm letting a slime ball like him erase this city. Yeah. Yeah. This city isn't going anywhere. Mm. Ha! Mm. Ha! Count it down with me, kids! Ten! Nine! Nine. Eight! Seven! seven six! Five! five four! Five, three! Two, one. Come on out. <laughs> so, what do you care?
kids feel like playing with today? How's about this one? Ready? Yeah! Let's do this! Shredded, yo! Perhaps we ought not engage? Is nothing short of a high tier dare. Yeah, something like that. I hate to see what else they can turn into. You're done for. Word is cute. Keep it going! Booyah! You like the nailed it! Booyaka! Booyaka! We actually got XP from that, super chill. Uh, full HP, and I have a full power. Okay, we need to get rid of this thing fucking ASAP. Oh, 
Okay, Yordi's getting slapped. I'm gonna change into my PJs, BRB. It's only 5 p.m., Lizzie. How are you already want to change in your PJs? Into your PJs, pajamas. All burned out. Black cat blades. I don't know what else to do. They won't die. I can cur. They're badly overpowered. Was all this really for nothing? These are far tougher than the ones I created. I can't even erase them. How's it looking, Hishima? Inauspicious, I'm afraid. Just hang on! Worry about the others, not me. Though I fear it may already be too late. Glad we can reconnect, old friend. Your fatuity never fails to make me smile. No! This noise. Please tell me we're not going to lose. Come on. Shiva's gone. So is Hishima. Uh, yo, Bones! If we sync up, maybe we can... Sweat, yo. I ain't going down that easy. Hey, Nagi, Fred, you good? Not at all! Help me! Goodbye, Fred. Fred! No. Damn it! These things are beyond us. There's gotta be another way. This ain't good! Beat! Neku! Neku! Turning back time would just make the noise even stronger, wouldn't it? Rindo? Sucks, you know. No, come on. And here I was, thinking we could finally play together in person. Huh? Vango, the new update ought to be out by now, right? How do you even know that? Uh, because we've been playing together for ages. 
didn't mean to go AWOL on you, though. My bad. She swallow? No! Wait. Does that mean you? I'm sorry I never replied to you. After I left the Reapers, they suspended my account. Anyway, later. No! Choki was Swallow? Is Swallow? Well, well, and then there was one. <laughs> Shit. Oh, you won't be needing that anymore. <laughs> the game's over, kid. And now, so Shibuya! Now, who the fuck is that? Nice nuke there, bro. What was that? What happened? Those shoes are familiar. Sort of. Uh. Oh, excuse me. It's okay. Did we just bump into each other? Yeah. No way. Oh. No way. I'm home. Mm. I'm back in the RG. But how? Wait, hold on a sec. Oh no. Where's Fred? He's gone. Shibuya, chapter end. The last day. Is it over? It's just cutscenes from now? I'm the only one who made it home. Bullshit. My chat apps back to the way it was before the game started. Except for the fact that Fred isn't in it. Nobody in school remembers him. And he's missing from my contacts. Same with Nagi and B. And Neku. Neku, everyone, they're just gone. Shoka too. Even her alt's gone. Like it never existed. There's thousands of people around me, and yet, I'm all alone. PJ's activated. Like Lizzie's that, way too early for PJ's. I back in time, I could save the city. And technically I did. Just not the way I wanted to. Was everything I did all for nothing? <sighs> and it workflows all day. Hey, friend. Hey, friend. Who the fuck are you? Man, it's a real concrete jungle out there, wouldn't you say? No, it's not what? someone I'm familiar with. You know, wild. I... <sighs> I don't know. I see. Well, to be completely honest with you, neither do I my first time here, and I'm feeling a bit overwhelmed. 
Think you could show me around, friend? Who the fuck are you? I'm uh, a bit busy here. Deserve comfort, Jordi. If earlier's better, I could take us back an hour or two. <gasps> what did he just say? Oh, I'm kidding. If only. Uh, yeah. But seriously, if you could spare a sec, I'd love to get a taste of your life here. Sorry, who are you? Oh, me? Azuki Mikagi. Who the fuck? Call me Haz. So, where do we start? Lead the way, friend. What's this guy's deal? Is he a player? player? That crosswalk looks like a promising place to begin. To me, at least. What do you think? Something feels off here. Give Haz a tour of Shibuya. Uh huh. Many of them are more than usual. I'm curious. Why do you why do you they choose to be together? Isn't it fun? I mean, must be. Lead the way. Wonderful. I can't even do the beat jump anymore. My level is the same. Well, three new people. This one. <sighs> I also need that one. We don't want a no tour. Say, friend. How do you know someone special to you? Do mm -hmm. you miss them? Want to help them when they're in trouble? Man, this place makes me... It's been really... I can't strain. Mm -hmm. No, just people. Lead the way in that case. Let me think this through. I'm hungry. What about you, friends? What about me? What do you feel about feelings? Slow. Or whatever, I guess. Oh, like one of those... Don't know. Interesting. Of course. It's a rather abstract concept. Oh, by the way. Yellow building nearby. Maybe. Perhaps loft, Let's see. <laughs> this is going slightly too fast. Oh, you... Are you more of a who needs some kind of guy? I wouldn't go that far. Don't know. Of course. It's a rather abstract concept. But everything is closed, Lizzie. So I can't really just, you know, get food. <laughs> Say, friend, what does respect mean to you? Never gave much thought. Don't you have a mer? Well, not really. What does respect mean to me? It's got a criteria. Say, friend. You think of notes? Barco is notable. Self, right? Come on. What the fuck is this random guy? Another rap. You're running out of rap soon. Hey friend, how do you handle a crisis? Do you yeah. turn and run, or do you stand to fight? Depends, I guess. Sure did a lot of fighting, although we didn't really have a choice. Probably sent the street to fight that. The guy's mind leading me away. It's literally light right there. You play games? Definitely not a fun or game, generally speaking, that is. Single out. Hmm, fancy go. He's not gonna send me a friend request, is he? Fascinating. I'd like to explore a bit more. Hmm. Feel more at ease with tour guide. Of course you would. Oh, friend. Gotta get foods. I don't wanna I want your need to die of hunger. I won't die of hunger. Hmm. Watch your friend. Are there things you say in your head different than the things you say out loud? I mean, sometimes, yeah. Speaking of which, there's a thing coming infiltrated, there's open so, so put the area ahead, that's Udagawa. Well, you know the city like the back of your hand, something like that. You must really love it here. Love it, huh? 
I'm not sure anymore. He says friend love, can we slap him? No. He's probably gonna save everyone. If we'd have to guess. Haven't you seen enough? Not yet. I wanna see what makes this city so great. I mean if you haven't seen it already. Fair enough. And it's not like we're having a stimulating conversation either. What's the point? Well, I'm pretty drained. I think I'll call it a day. Okay, Rendell. Hmm? Uh, how does he know my name? But while I've got you, I should take this chance to apologize. For what? For Kubo. He's a real piece of work. Kubo? Yeah. Kubo? Wait. Kubo? Kubo? You see, I originally sent him to Shinjuku. He was tasked with cleansing the city, and he completed his mission. Cleansing? What, like a janitor? The thing is, he didn't stop there. He got a little overzealous and tried to cleanse Shibuya, too. He's always been something of an overachiever. I've taken care of him, though, so I hope you can forgive me. Taken care of care him? him. Oh, hold on! Who the hell are you? Hazuki. But please, call me Haz. That's not what I mean. Who are you that you made Kubo destroy Shinjuku and then erased him for overstepping? Well, not destroy, cleanse. And I didn't erase him, I exercised him. Like a demon? As I said, Kubo crossed a line. And for that, I wish to apologize. I have punished him, and erased his noise, and even kept this city of yours from harm. That light... He really was the one who stopped Kubo back there. Although I must say, I probably wouldn't have come here otherwise. <laughs> Tell me, Rendo, what is it that you like so much about this city? What makes it so special? Why fight so hard to protect it? I don't know. Like has been. Doesn't feel very special right now. Definitely not compared to how it felt before, at least. Honestly, I can't think of a single thing I like about this city anymore. I don't get it. You went through all that trouble. Seems to me like you got what you wanted. I guess I did. I thought I did. But this Shibuya isn't the one I fought for. It's different. I see. How about this? What if you could turn back time and try again? Would you do it? Uh, or are you content to leave things as they are? Uh, what do you what ask? ask? Take a look at that pin of yours. <gasps> you can go back if you wish. Everything will return to the way it was. Including, including the, the noise. noise. Once the time strikes, it'll emerge stronger than before. And when it does, you and your friends will have to erase it yourselves. Just us? Yep, you're on your own this time. I've already done what I can to make amends for what happened here. Any more, and then I'd be the one overstepping. Sure, this is it. I've got one last chance to get it right. If I don't, then Shibuya gets erased for good. Hell, I might even end up right back where I started. Hmm. I saved so many innocent people. Only to put their lives on the line again. <laughs> and what do we do about that noise? If we were barely hanging on before... Make chicken, chicken sandwich on a now. burrito bun cheese and lectus. Sounds nice. If I were you, I wouldn't bother turning back time even if I could. It's too risky. Oh. That said, I also don't understand what about this city makes it so special, but you do. And if you think that something is truly worth fighting for, then perhaps turning back time and trying again is worth the risk after all. Maybe. 
Shibuya's already been fated for destruction once before. A fate undone by the very power available to you now. In that sense, it's safe to say the decision is yours. I can't decide just like that. <laughs> Well, if you won't decide, I guess I will. What? We'll just leave things the way they are now. That feels appropriate. The city is safe, as are its citizens. W wait a sec. You now stand between two planes, life and death. When you're ready, pitch that pin and you'll return to the RG for good. I... I should probably head back myself. My work here's done, after all. Thanks again for the tour. See you, Rindo. Wait! Pass, wait! What's up? I made my decision. I'm doing it. I'm going back. This time, I'm gonna save the city and my friends. Without them? All of this means nothing. Shibuya isn't special without them here! Uh-huh. Thanks for fixing the pin, and for giving me another chance. I won't waste it. I promise. I hope you don't. I hope you don't. As I said, the decision is yours. But with that decision comes responsibility. You've decided to once again expose this city to the threat of erasure. And to that end, you're now responsible for protecting this city from harm once more. I will. I promise. Only time will tell. I'll be watching. I'll be watching. I think I would have liked it better if Joshua had appeared or something. To save our asses. Thanks, Haz. getting erased this time neither is the city just hang in there together we'll change our fate together we will change our fate I won't let anything happen to Shibuya or my friends Shibuya is on the verge of destruction. What the? But I won't let that happen. <laughs> the whole city! <laughs> let us make the decision, like, what if we race. didn't want our friends back? I want our friends back. What the fuck are I you talking about, Lizzie? Our future. Greetings, sheeple of Shibuya. Sheeple of Shibuya. The final day is finally upon us. Or Shibuya's third fucking time. Can't turn back now, even if I want to. Gotta make it count. Well, this is it. You ready? Yeah. Thanks. So. Uh, as do I. Listen. I've got to tell you all something. Okay. You see, I'm here because I turned back time. Oh? Does that mean we didn't make it? You didn't. But I wasn't going to accept that. Saving the city doesn't mean a thing if there's no one here to enjoy it with. So we're going to save Shibuya. And nobody's getting erased this time. In other words, some among us were erased last time? Yeah, unfortunately. Which is exactly why I decided to come back. And believe me, I'm really glad that I did. But the real fight is still ahead. And this time, 
It's gonna be even tougher. How come? Am I forgetting a special Reaper rule or something? The noise that spawns when you turn back time, that's the real threat. Right. It grows stronger every time I use my powers. Which means coming back here made it even worse. Who the hell would come up with something so wack, yo? Kubo would. Who? Oh, right. You haven't had the pleasure. Hold your phone, yo! Kubo? I've no recollection of that name. What? Was he one of your guys? No. At least I don't think so. Although, I feel like I know that name What so the far. fuck? Yeah. Now that you mention it, I think I do too. Nobody remembers who Kubo is. Nobody except me. But why? Although, I guess I forgot too. Technically. Wait. Kubo? I didn't erase him. I exercised him. So that's what he meant by exercised. He removed Kubo from this world entirely. How am I supposed to explain that? Uh, you okay there? Huh? Oh, yeah. Well, hopefully we can avoid this bad future you saw. Not just bad. It was the worst. If we want to succeed, we'll need all the help we can get. Just gotta think it through. Plan it all out. And team up to take him down. Him? You mean Kubo? Yeah. It's not about Shibuya or Shinjuku anymore. The game's over. So what is it about? The Executor. He's not here anymore, but he's our real enemy. It's all of us against his noise. Okay. If you say so, it must be true. I'm with you. <sighs> Good. Bolsy noise cause bloom bulls noise symbols to appear when revisiting previous complete days. Okay. We ship in change our fate. For fucking final day and bulls fight, this is taking too long. around your neck this is a uh, thing you can use to size up your arms legs and things give me a break yo it's texting you nobody girls nobody drop it i that's his sister rhyme so i can't believe she hacked her way into the rns she gotta have some pretty mad skills to manage that wait wasn't Kai the one who designed the rns huh yeah, why? That's what I thought. Did you hear me? Mm. But I am doing something. I'm waiting for a certain someone. Then that means the person Kaya was waiting for, the one who holds incredible power. Power or not of the supernatural variety. Yeah, something like that. It's your sister texting Rhyme, right? Blah? Oh, you hell. Oh, yeah, right, future. Yeah, is she the one responsible for hacking the RNS? Wait, fracking? Uh, no. Not that. I mean, yeah, she might have done that. Damn. She ain't giving me all the details. She just told me she's in. Seriously, yo? Now she's saying she finally meets with development or something. Sounds sketchy to me, so I just told her I'm not yet to, yo. Maybe able to offer some assistance, and if we are to save the city, we will find we'll need all the help we can find. B, think your sister wants to meet up with Kaye. For real, yo? Yeah, for real. I'm pretty sure they're trying to devise a plan to save Shibuya. 
For real, for reals? Yeah, Kai has been waiting for Ryman for a while now. He mentioned about how she got incredible powers and how he needs her help in order to save the city. I mean, she is pretty powerful. I already told her to stay away, man. Her and Shiki both told him it's too dangerous here. Right. You're not entirely wrong. And even if they did make it here, who's gonna protect him? He got an oyster raise and shit, and I ain't fine put in harm's way, yo, not gonna happen, not again. But she told me she just arrived at the station. Dang, that was fast. She said she's on her way to Udagawa, yo. Can we at least get someone to escort her there? Someone in the area, near the station, actually. We're gonna meet Coco at Tower Records later. Pixie chick, calm down, she's on our side, remember? I spent enough time with her back in Shinjuku to know. Aight, uh, if you say so, man. Let's ask her. Must be pretty dependable if she earns Neku's trust. Hmm. It's more likely she trusts him, which is why he can ask a favor or such. Uh, were we to attempt the same, we would be doubtlessly dismissed with a laugh and a bye bye or so, I believe. Okay. Oops. Took a little cajoling, but she's in. Told her to take Ryan to Mikai. Why is he making her walk all the way to Udagawa, yo? He ought to at least meet her somewhere closer, like Dokozaka. I'm gonna have her tell him to meet her halfway instead. Okay. Before he met up with Kai at Udagawa, and now he and Ryan are set to rendezvous with Dokozaka. Dokozaka is all the way on the other side, mate. Station is down, and... <sighs> Should head there next. Fuck me. Rhyme Chan. Okay, man, it's a Dogen Saga. Rhyme and Kai should be here. Now I've just gotta find him. It's very easy. They both stick out like sore thumbs. B! Rhyme! Rhyme! Whoa, 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 hold on a sec. That's Beat's sister. My. Uh huh. Uh huh. What you trying to say, yo? Hello there. Hey there, Rhyme. Name's Tosai Furusawa, but my friends call me Fred. And my name is Raimu Bito. Raimu Bito. But you can call me Rhyme. And you two must be Rindo and Nagi, I presume. That's me. Pleased to meet you. At least by four of you. Where are Neku and Shoka? Uh, right here. How come you acting like you can't see him? Actually, I don't think she can. You're all still alive, but not us. Me and him are part of the Eugeno. Couldn't see Koko or Kaya either. But Koko sent me a message to the Reaper Creeper. And Kaya just texted me like always. Reaper Creeper? Definition game in which a coin moves across a piece of paper of its own accord. Uh... Oh yeah, that was part of the first game. Why you keep saying mate? Mate? Because I can, mate. Gross. Got a lot of nerve asking a favor at a time like this. I'm super busy lady, you know? I know, I'm sorry. Sorry, Shmari. You're lucky I do just about anything to save Shibuya. Anyways, laters. Hi there, Rindo. Ram and I are hard at work analyzing our foe. We've discovered some strange entities lurking in Shibuya. Entities bearing an eerie resemblance to our own spiritual energies. I think those are the noise that spawn when I use my powers. More of them appear each time I use the clock time. And I'm pretty sure even more will appear next time we face them. The signs point to yes, unfortunately. Data should be the only information that exists here. But it seems there are corrupted data hidden throughout the city. And it is thus now our job to get that data under control. How do we do that? Hey. Are you talking to Kaye? I don't know if we could call what we found corrupt data like he does. But whatever it is, there sure is a whole lot of it. That's what we up against. Afraid um, so. And as it stands, we're solely outnumbered. Hey. Which suggests our odds of success or non-existence. Well, Kai and I are going to try brainstorm a way to get rid of some of the data. Two heads are better than one. In the meantime, we'll need you to recruit as many people as we can to help. 
well prepared is well well prepared is well armed as they say uh they yo our intellect is most impressive hey neku don't like she can hear me phone's just now nope fortunately but I can kind of tell what he's saying from the look on your face. <laughs> or at least that you two managed to find each other. Once this is all over, we'll bring you back to life, Licky Split. Here's hoping. I know Shiki can't wait to see you either. So you'd better not let her down, okay? I won't. He already has bunny ears. I don't have bunny ears. You ain't Australian, no. But I can still say me. Said he won't, yo. I know. So Ravikar are gonna come up with a way to erase the noise. And it's our job to find people who can help us fight back. But who do we ask, Shiba, I guess? Of the game already. He has a bisque ass, but convincing him to team up too? No, that's too... That'll be too tough. <laughs> it's funny, I never thought I'd have a Reaper asking me for help. Nor did I imagine an RG dweller could infiltrate the RNS. You have certainly proven yourself to be a force to reckon with. It would be foolish of me not to request your aid, if you say so. Uh... But still, you're full of surprises. You think a Reaper wouldn't be so eager to help my brother and his team, let alone go so far as to stand up against the Game Master? Are you sure you want to do this? Oh. Yes. I must, if I am to realize my dream and digitally archiving every possible phenomenon, that is one heck of a dream. Your assistance in data analysis has been invaluable. To think we managed to explain even this phenomenon, and there is still work to be done in regards to Shinjuku, though nothing is left of the data. Not to mention the allure of examining Shibuya's unique vibes. I wish for nothing more than to continue analyzing and archiving as much data as possible. And you're with us then? Indeed I am. I'm glad. And I hope your dream comes true. Many thanks, Ryan. Now let's get to work, shall we? We're still not there. This is highly frustrating. I can't say, like, we're stopping right here and now, right? That's just freakishly dumb. If I do that... We'll probably have like another hour and a half gameplay. Finding Hishima and enlisting his help. If anyone can persuade Shiba to join him. Greetings. I met Wicked Twisters. Um... Something is rather unpleasant. Hi, Shiba. I wanted to talk to you about something. Received word from Shibuya Reapers asking to spend the game. A situation changed? Sort of, yes. Turn back time again, which means your plan was unsuccessful. Or my process is insufficient of changing. No, not at all, actually. You actually did a great job. The thing is, it wasn't enough. We're gonna need to convince him to join our cause. Quite a tall order, I know. But you do think you can give it one more try? Technically speaking, this would be my first attempt. I shall try, but enlisting his aid will doubtless be difficult, you think so? Indeed, I've not seen him cooperate once in all the years I've known him. No. I just... Question will come the timing. Yet while I may be able to persuade him to hold his actions, him to change his actions is another beast entirely. Would you, if would I were only able to imprint a new idea in a stubborn head of his, I would certainly make things easier. If you could find someone to show him the error of his ways, then perhaps there is hope yet, but who could do that? Sugumi, presumably. She's been at his side longer than most. Fortunately, however, I have no idea where you might find her now. Coco should be keeping her safe somewhere. Not sure how much help she'll be given Mr. Mew's current state. But I can try reaching out to Coco. Oh, what is it? Yeah, tell us. I need your help, Rindo. With? Remember when we asked Coco to escort Rhyme to meet with Kaye? Coco just happened to be in the area. Well, the reason she was there is because she was waiting for Shiki. Isn't she the friend of yours? Yeah, the one who brought Mr. Mew to life. Apparently, Coco was going to take Shiki to Tsugumi and have her fix it all. If we can get her to that, then Tsugumi should be free from her plushy prison. 
which means we might be able to ask her for help, except Coco's not there anymore. See... She left to go see Aramakaya. Maybe she... We can find somewhere else to keep Aram safe. Guess we should head back to Tokyo Plaza and start looking there. We're going again. Time travel! Here we go again! Listen, all this time travel is just so bad. We're just making things worse. The same. To meet Kai, they've been working together to analyze the noise. They're trying to give us a fighting chance. Oh, they is? Wait, how the hell do you know about my sister, yo? Alright, future. Exactly. And I know that we need your sister's help. The only way we'll be able to erase the noise. She's supposed to meet Kaias up with Kaia somewhere in Dozaka, and I'm going to find someone who can escort her there, keep her safe. <sighs> it's come as too dangerous to come back here, but it ain't about what I think no more and bigger than that. I can tell cause uh, how serious you Zack the men, so what you need me to tell her. You get somebody lined up to keep her safe, or what? That's it! Hey, Yuzuki. Yes. Do you know Beat Sister Rhyme? Rhyme uh, Rhyme Ubito? I'm familiar. She just arrived at Shibuya Station. She's trying to meet with Kaya and Dogazaka. Would you be able to take her there? Hang on a sec. You do realize I have other things to do, right? Please, Shibuya's fate depends on this. You're saying the city's gonna be erased if I don't help? Yeah. Fine, I don't get it, but I'll do it. Just from the station to Dogenzaga, right? I'm heading over from Cat Street now. Should be there soon. Thank you so much. Let her know I'm on my way, least. Will do. At least this game gives you your money's worth, true. Now who's gonna tell her about... Tell... Let Uzuki scream at Hasaki, whatever his name was. Isiki. Always really brainstorming to them. Now Shiki should be able to go to repair Miss Mew. Should allow Hishima to get in touch with Tsugumi. I hope this works. We'll change our fate. Tipsy Toes Hall. It's true. Definitely money's worth. Back to Tipsy Toes Hall again. Wonder if Tsugumi finally free. Yeah. If she's okay. We're fine. She's got Mr. Mew Creator on her side. Huh? So, oh, nothing. I was just thinking about that creator. They've got the one who started got the narrow too, right? Wear a lot of their stuff, so I thought it might be kind of cool to meet them or whatever. Yeah, totally. I'm sure, Neku can introduce you once it's all over. Yeah, totally. Totally. Shiba. Three years ago, he said he wanted to take Shinjuku to new heights. Some heights those are now to be. Was he lying to us? We believed him, all the Shinjuku Reapers did, so we fought for change against the status quo against the Game Master. And for what? So this Kubo guy could get his way? Just pissed me off, huh? What? Didn't say anything? This whole situation sucks. But if Shinjuku didn't get destroyed, I would never have met Rindo. Come on, we gotta keep going, everything's gonna turn out okay. Everything? Well, if you say so. Ready to indulge you with taste of witty sense of humor. Yeah, one of those. Just get the point, dummy. This guy trying to erase Shibuya, he's gone. He? You don't remember a reaper by the name of Kubo, do you? Can't say I do. Didn't think so, let me explain. Unsurprising. Sounds like Hishima the Heartless. I sound like Hishima the Heartless, don't I? A little bit. If the epithet fits, I think I would be stubbornly unwilling to cooperate. Well, you said to yourself, anyone that can convince Shiba to change his ways, Tsugumi, not you. Indeed. I would say it again now, based on what I've heard. 
But do you know where she is? Well, I think she's stuck. What? She hasn't been freed yet. She's still stuck inside. But how? Coco just messaged me. She's to give me safe in the cafe on Cat Street. But she can't bring Shiki in to help on account of all the noise nearby. And I don't think Kiari uh, can help. Can handle him all by himself. God damn it. Damn! Right, I forgot Karia was on his own. A little shorthanded at the moment, but I'll be busting my ass to make it up for it. Doesn't have Uzuki to help him out anymore, but maybe we can step in to help instead. We're going again. Repeat! We keep repeating our shenanigans. Just gotta need help and quick. What to do? Listen, what are our pins doing right now? I'm not gonna change my pins for this I'm on the move. I'm just gonna keep going with it. Get it, Yordi? How's it hanging, wicked twisters? Hey, Kari. So the rumors are true. You really are back, Phones. In the flesh. You holding up okay? I've been better, man. Those noise really did a number on me. Twisted titties. Wish Uzuki could have stuck around to lend a hand, but it is what it is. And what it is, is teeming with noise. Yeah, something funny about that cafe. It's drawing in noise like flies to a lollipop. No rest yeah, I did. the wicked, I guess. Please, let us help. Can't say no to an offer like that. Sorry, but you're no match for me. Don't do anything stupid. Chocolate lakes. Well done. You like that? Lizzie, I'm glad you're enjoying the comedic relief of me twisting the nipples. So my goodie bags had a free umbrella and pens and no pad. Goodie bag. Yeah. What else? Sanitizer. Oh, nice. And well, the candies and brownies. Candy from the candy man. Bad, right? The noise are not innumerable. 
She's right. And we don't exactly have all day here. We've got to convince Shiba to help us before it's too late. There's got to be something we can do to stop the noise. But what? What can we do? <laughs> What's the matter, Zeptograms? You having trouble calculating the distortion? Huh? Mr. Minami? Minami? Crunch! Crunch! Take your time. Well, well. Looks like you took Taboo to a whole new level. You! What you doing here, Pipe Face? Just came to check my figures. See what that little variable I integrated can really do, you know? Unfortunately, I don't. But does this mean we can leave the noise to you? Uh, hold up, phones! Listen, we need to go see Shiba as soon as possible. What do you say? Can you lend us a hand here? For Shibuya's sake? Hm. The only sake that interests me is my own. All the more reason to help us, then. I know you've got your sights set on the city. And you can't take over if it gets erased. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on to you, Zeptogram. You manipulated time again, didn't you? Now that trash you made was too tough to handle. So, am I, am right? I right? Yeah. Good night. Actually, Sleep well, SQ. You're spot on. But I'm doing everything I can to save the city and us. <laughs> I've already factorized the garbage you created. Turns out, it's a product of the rejected cognitive energy of souls lost to time. And that energy keeps multiplying. Huh? Wait a sec. Didn't that Kubo guy say something like that before? All the cognitive energy from that would have been history gets replaced with a brand new set of thoughts. But now that old cognitive energy's got no way to go. It's just waste. Back, back, back. And all that energy is stored right here, inside this pin. Every time I changed our fate, that noise grew stronger. And now, it's so strong we don't stand a chance against it. Your odds of winning are close to zero, but not equivalent. How so? If you align similar figures to the original soul's coordinates, you can overwrite them. Uh, overwrite how? By taking the cognitive trash you created with that pin, and replacing all those lost souls with the living souls of Shibuya. Oh. But in order to do that, we need to awaken the people's consciousness. What do you mean? Can't beat that trash while Shibuya's still an operative. I'll leave the rest of the calculations to you. So it's not impossible, but it's pretty damn close. Rindo, how are we supposed to awaken the people's consciousness? Maybe Kaye will know what to do. I'm sure he and Rhyme will be able to come up with something. Beat! Sup? Can you relay all that stuff Minami Moto just said to Rhyme? She and Kaye might be able to come up with a way to suppress the noise. Oh, for sure! You got it, man. So, uh, what the, what the hell did Pi Face say exactly? How about this? I'll talk, you type. Okay. All that's left is convincing Shiba to help. Minami Moto's got the noise at the cafe under control. Which means Tsukumi should be freed soon enough. Everything's gonna work out. I'm gonna make sure it does. No matter what. Man, time travel sure sounds slick. Even if it's not without its downsides. Gotta say though, I'm surprised. You never struck me as the advice-giving type of guy. I'm not in it for them. The only equation I'm interested in solving is my own. <laughs> He's a real character, that one. But hey, True. Guess I can't complain as long as he's on our side. Don't you just love it when he looks at you? Breaking that fourth wall there. We'll change our fate. Okay, again. Rindo. You okay there? Yeah, I'm fine. 
You don't abide that even on edge all day. Like you're fighting for your life. I mean, you're not wrong. Holy shit, Askew is still alive. Yeah. It's like uh, 4 a.m. for her. I don't want to get erased, and I don't want anyone else to get erased either. I'm doing everything I can to make sure that that doesn't happen. Good. Hey, is Hishima? Well met, wicked twisters. Listen, we need your help. You sound as if you've rehearsed that line. I've definitely said it before. I had a feeling. A sensation not unlike deja vu. Even though you've changed the course of fate, it seems a portion of my previous consciousness has remained intact. You appear troubled. It's just, those memories will combine with others like it to become an enormous noise. That's what we're up against. I see. And if we want to stand a chance, we'll need all the help we can get, including yours and Sheba's. Do you think you can convince him to lend us a hand? I can't object to someone more prescient than myself, though Shiba is not easily persuaded. Yeah, you mentioned that before. You said Tsugumi could help. Well, now she's finally free, which means you should be able to get a hold of her now. Mind giving it a try? You want Tsugumi and I to ask Shiba to lend us his strength? It's the only way. Please. Very well. None among us desires Shibuya's destruction. I shall do what I can to assist you in your plight. Thank you. I'll see you at the crossing then. Okay, Hishima and Sugumi should be able to get Shiba on our side. But that leaves the noise. No, that'll be fine. Ram and Kaya will figure something out. I just know they will. Neku sounds weird. He does sound weird. His voice is way deeper. And Rami should have met up by now. Go check on them. Surely they've come up with something. Just hope it's not too late. B. B. Rhyme. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on a sec. That's Beat's sister? Good to see you too. Wait, you know her, Rim Dude? Hi there, I'm Rhyme Obito, but you can call me Rhyme. Oh, well, I'm Tosai Furusawa, but you can call me Fred. Fred, and you must be Nagi. Which would make you Rindos, right? Thanks for reaching out. I think I got what Minamimoto was saying. Good. So, were you able to come up with anything? Wait, Math Man? What's he got to do with this? Well, he's not exactly cooperating with us. But he did provide us with a little intel about the noise we're up against. It's made from the lost souls left behind when I turn back time. If you align similar figures to the original soul's coordinates, you can overwrite them. By taking the cognitive trash you created with that pin, and replacing all those lost souls with the living souls of Shibuya. Hmm. So those lost souls are the corrupted data we've identified. But if we can tap into the souls that exist in this timeline, we should be able to use them to erase all that excess data. Yet his radiance sounded less than optimistic. He said we must first awaken the people's collective consciousness. Yeah, Shibuya Syndrome has really thrown a wrench into things. Indeed. The people's souls have been sapped of their energy. They may not give much help in their current state. That said, human souls are known to regenerate on their own. Time heals all wounds, as Rhyme would say. Exactly. So long as the affected souls remain intact, we should be able to aid their recovery and get them to lend us their strength. Let's see. We've got Fred and Nagi, then Neku. We can... well, he can provide backup. What you trying to say? And Neku's strong, so he should be at the center of the network. Does that make it a Neku work? Why Neku work. That? What do you think, Kaye? <laughs> exactly. You know, maybe this will work after all. So, Rindo. Uh, yeah? If we combine all our powers together, I think we might just have a fighting chance here. 
Uh, you really think so? Be this back of dancer. I do, and I've got this plan. Operation Awakening. Pretty cool, right? Yeah, but what is it? Well, Neku uses his powers to sync up with everyone in Shibuya. All of them? Yep, then Nagi uses her powers to open their minds. Tis a daunting task. And that's when you come in, Fred. You're gonna get them excited. Uh, how, how exactly? By using your powers to remind people of the joy they felt here in Shibuya. Right now, they've forgotten the thrill of life. But you are gonna help them all remember. Rhyme's voice is nice. Kaye and I will help too, but we've gotta get ready. We'll catch up with you later. Okay, great. Thanks, Rhyme. See you in a bit. What do we unlock with Rhyme? Fango Fanatic sometimes increases the groove earned from beat combos performed by Rindo and Shoka. Hmm. We'll change our fate. It's like me when I'm nice at work. Oh, that doesn't sound too great. So first we talk to some sense in Shiba, then we do it. what again? Did you even read what Kai sent us? I'm just gonna sync up with everyone in Shibuya from the crossing. That Sugumi sends out a vision to awaken up the consciousness from on, on top of 104. At least their minds ready for open to Nagi. Once she does that, Fred can send them her mind words. So what are we supposed to do? Back up and defend? Reaper's is taking care of the noise, yeah? Yeah, and once we have Shiba on our side, split up and work from there. I'm sure of the feasibility of this plan. But if we don't feast it, Shibuya's toast. The whole city's counting on us. That right. We'll handle the noise prowling about the city. Perfect. Thanks, Kaya, for the whole swallow thing, too. You are most welcome. It was always it was my pleasure. Just want to thank you while I still can. It wasn't for the account you made for me. Probably still be friendless and alone, but I'm not anymore. I'm happy for you. It's wonderful to see you've finally learned to open up. Yes. It always stuck me as profound profound lonely. And you were so cold to others. I want to help somehow. And I thought since you struggle with face to face communication, why not try digital medium? And it appears to have worked. Incidentally, if you're reinstated as a Reaper, I will be able to return your Swallow account to you. Thanks, but no thanks. Are you certain? Yeah. Now let's do this. Shiba! Well, look who it is. My favorite sheeple. My favorite sheeple. I think I've heard this lay now five Shiba, times. Listen. Tsugumi? And you... Quite the odd couple. Not to mention the motley crew standing behind you. We need your help. Please. Is that really you in there? She's as real as she's ever been. Someone sealed her soul inside that doll, and now she's finally free. What a pleasant surprise. In any case, the game is still afoot. I'd appreciate it if you stayed out of my way. Perhaps you haven't heard, but the rules have been revised. I'd be mortified if I were caught abiding by outdated protocol. <laughs> Never thought I'd see the day when you'd be offering me advice. But go on. Enlighten me. What have I missed? Who had the audacity to revise the rules to my game without my permission? His name is Kubo. Do you remember? Kubo? He's a player. No, a reaper. Was a reaper, but he got erased. What did he do? He gave you new powers. Named you the executor. Hang on. How do you know about all that? And moreover, why is it that I can't remember? Because Kubo was exercised in the future. Exercised? Removed from existence entirely. 
from the UG, the RG, even from your memories. Even though he was running the game with you this whole time, Kubo may be gone, but his rules are still in play. He's made sure this game will end in total chaos. And why should I believe you? Because I was one of his pawns too. He used us to erase Shibuya. Which is precisely what I desire as well. No, you don't. I've seen the future and you don't survive. You get swallowed up by the noise just like he planned. <laughs> he used you to erase Shinjuku. That's the reason Kubo approached you in the first place. I have reason to believe he may have been an angel sent to destroy the city. An angel? Assuming he was, everything begins to make sense. He hid among the shadows, granting you the powers that would help him erase Shinjuku. Then, he donned the guise of a reaper, and began to monitor those of us who survived. Kaie and Suzukichi immediately noticed a change in your demeanor. They suspected foul play and sought to uncover the truth. Sadly, their efforts proved futile, as would any opposition toward a being of the higher plane. So you're saying I was some sort of puppet? Made to dance by this charlatan? Precisely. How exhausting it must have been to have your strings pulled for three, four years. Damn, you ain't really much of a people person, huh? Never has been. You left your friends behind in your single-minded lust for power. What are you talking about? You left me behind! I may have. You did, and the rest followed. Dance, monkey, dance. They were worried about you. I heard their hearts crying out in pain. Kaie, Suzukichi, Ayano, and Shoka, even Hishimi. None of them could bear to look at the monster you've become. <laughs> and ever since you received those new powers, you shut me out. You stopped listening. Well, can you blame me? You kept showing me those depressing visions. I couldn't let myself get distracted by them. Then allow me to show you the truth you've been ignoring. The hour of reckoning is drawing near. Just once, I need you to see what cruel fate awaits us. All of us. That means you too. I know. I lived through it. Shiva, open your heart to me. <sighs> Come, open your heart. It's an enormous amalgam of noise, one that grows stronger whenever I turn back time. Kubo, set a timer, and when it runs out, the noise will emerge from this pin to devour us all. We have to stop it, but we're going to need your help. <laughs> and what, pray tell, will become of my game? Is that all you can think of in our hour of need? You misunderstand. I'll gladly help you take care of the noise created by this Kubo. My concern lies with what happens after the battle is won. <clears throat> Fine. If it's a fight you want, then I'm game. <laughs> then it's time for a pestilent resurgence. You mean... The plague. It eats through planar boundaries. That noise will be nothing. Besides, that abhorrent angel was kind enough to bless me with these powers. Shouldn't let him burn a hole in my pocket. Thank you. Seriously, thanks. But if we are to stand a chance, we'll need to turn the heat up higher than ever before. Kishima, Sugumi, lend me a hand. I need you to rouse the citizens of Shibuya from their stupor. Light them up and set their souls ablaze! Welcome back, old friend. It's funny. I haven't felt a fever like this in years. Now let's get out there and burn this game to the ground. Lightning in my hands, hurt the three electricity attacks target surrounding enemies. 
We're going again. Time to change your fate. For the 500th time. Time to reawaken Shibuya's imagination. Everybody ready? God's willing. Just breathe. We got this, boss. I'm all fired up. Take care of Tsugumi, will you, friend? I shall ease the burden on her psyche. You just focus on listening to their voices. Great. Thank you, Hishima. I'll make sure their cries are heard. You can count on me. And I'll reach out to Ryan. Sounds good. I don't know, Ryan. You sure you can handle this, yo? She can. Yep, no need to worry about me. Man, I still can't believe you came all the way out here, yo. Just look at you, all ready to save the city and shit. Aren't you proud of me? <laughs> I'd be prouder if I wasn't so worried I know, I know. But see, I made it. Safe and sound. All that worrying for nothing. Hey, can it, phones? Wait, is Neku here too? Yep. I guess you're still in between worlds. Our Neku's been completely confined to the UG. Mm -hmm. Ryan! Sorry for the wait. No worry, Shiki. You're just Shiki! 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 Nice. Misaki Shiki. He's here, isn't he? Yep, right over there. You mean you can see him? See him, talk to him, smack him on the head if I want. You finally came back to us. I knew you would. Neku, I don't know if you can see me right now. But I'm... So glad you're here. Shiki. I can see you just fine. And soon, you'll be able to see me too. Uh, you want me to translate, yo? Don't worry about it. <laughs> we'll see each other later. Oh, I just got a message from Kaye. Everyone. Sync up with Neku's consciousness. Lend him your strength. Been doing it for years, yo. Okay, we should be fine, theoretically. But it's a lot of stress on Neku. I'm worried about him. Don't be. Don't be. Said he'll be fine, yo. Tell him he better be. Commence Operation Awakening. Feels like the fog's starting to lift for me, too. Oh, you've still got a long ways to go. Try a little harder, will ya? I I never thought I'd say this, but I think it's time for me to get to work. Um, can somebody explain how I got roped into this freaking mess? Uh, this is like literally the worst. I know I'm irresistibly adorable, but can't you all just buzz off? <laughs> Mini Moto. Mini Moto. Seriously. Zero seven seven three four. Ew. Ew. Hey, Zero seven seven three four. Walk away, you jerk. Whatevs. As long as he's doing his job. You better do yours too, Neku. Good bones? 
Neku? What's happening? Is everything all right? Yeah. Tell her I'm fine. Says to tell you he's good. <sighs> well, we haven't got much time left. <sighs> Need a hand there, partner? Joshua! Josh? Chris kid? What the fuck is he doing here? To this little reunion. What so is he I'm doing here? I must say, this is quite the impressive scheme you've devised. I hope you don't mind if I stick around and observe. Not at all, partner. Josh, what the fuck are you okay. doing here? Get ready, what guys. is Joshua doing here? The fated hour is almost upon us. What happens next is anyone's guess. Are you gonna dance with Happy? No. Whoa, are you okay? Stay strong, Nagi. It appears she's predisposed to absorbing negative imagination. Mm -hmm. I feel fine. Glad to be of service. I rechannel that depressive energy outward. Emotional redirection. In a sense. Yeah. Those noise keep multiplying. Kaye, Sugumi, Hishima, let's go lend the boss a hand. We'll keep the noise at bay. You just do what you gotta do. Understood. I shall do my utmost. Open thy minds unto me and pardon the intrusion! Yeah, true. Right! Nagi managed to dive inside! You're up! Roger that, buddy! Roger that, buddy. Time for a reminder. You ready, Shibuya? Come on, Remind everyone about these nuts. <sighs> Make a giant these nuts joke. It's time. Yo, Rindo! B, Neku! Nice work out there, you guys! The once soundless city is silent no more. The people's voices are returning to the crossing. Huh. Sounds like Shibuya is already looking a lot better from their side. We should be all set to intercept the noise. Remember, they're just mindless thoughts. Let's show them what Shibuya is made of. Yeah, any minute now. You sure we can win? We have to. <sighs> Can't play Fango if we don't. F Fango? Yeah. Uh huh. Whatever keeps you motivated, I guess. <gasps> there goes. Can I have normal milk instead of chocolate milk right after this? Because I'm kind of getting Damn. sick of it. It's How chocolate milk. I had like five glasses this evening. Okay. Look skyward. What's happening? It looks like 
looks like they're fighting or something. Those yeah. Those the time are trying to take control, but Shibuya is fighting back. They stopped. All that still ain't enough? No, but it was enough to give us a good head start. Super demon noise. A bird? Or like Phoenix. Sure is gaudy. All those noise came back and merged into one, like some nefarious Phoenix. <clears throat> Are we fine? I'm going serious gaming mode, guys. Joker. All balls on the <laughs> All balls on deck, she says. Okay, phase one down. Take it away! Mm -hmm. 
Next phase. Quit sending me away, yo! What an annoying boss. Feels like I'm playing Kingdom Hearts 2's final boss again. It's sending me flying the entire time. Just so that I can do a little bit of damage. But he's less annoying, I do gotta say he's less annoying than Shiba was. Shiba was more of a pain in the ass than... Oh, he's dead. We win. At least maybe we win. Did we beat it? Is the victory ours at last? Probably not. Hold up. Something ain't right. You're right. Look. What in the world is it doing? I am so ready for this to be over. Well, it ain't over yet. Literally a fucking phoenix, mate. That's disgusting. Risen from the ashes. Is it immortal? I don't think so. Let's finish this. For real! Just keep hitting it till it stays down, yo! It's exactly the same boss as before. Holy sh Oh, he reset my scan. Oh nice, we gotta do the dorging on time. Is it over? With music. Not yet. Now's our time to strike back. Thank <laughs> you. 
It really looked like this is our time to strike back, though. Seeing as nothing hurts him. Oh! Taking too much damage is really bad. <sighs> okay, we're gonna do this again. At least we're on 300 and we can blast him in a bit. We're not dead. We're fine. What the fuck is that? Don't just warp through the laser game. Anyways. Nice one, girl. Oh, yeah. 
<sighs> we're getting there, we're getting there slowly. Holy shit, what the fuck is he doing now? Close in again, are we? I hope so. Die already. Just a little more. We've got this. Don't let up now. Gotta say, Rindo, you sure have changed. Huh? Yeah, you're finally making your own decisions. Hell yeah, I am. Don't let your guard down. Roger that, yo. Onward, soldiers. Almost there. Like that. I think this is it. It is. So don't screw it up. Seems all tails are dead. Seriously, this is very confusing to look at. Again, flying back. Oh, not the big boy lasers again. Dealing no damage to this piece of shy, sir. Oh, 
Hey, hey, we got him. One last hit. Everybody ready? Let's make it count. Look at her doing it to come at me, huh? This is it. We're gonna take back this city. Through five hundred. Yeah, this is at least a very epic way to fucking finish it off. Killer Blast, 999. Good final set piece. Noise erased. D took me fucking 20 minutes to kill. Oh, good lord. We did it. It's gone. Seriously? Like, did we actually beat that thing? Go grab a glass of milk. Damn right we Thirsty. did. Come on, don't cry, boss! Well, Rindo, it worked. Yeah, thanks to you. I'm just glad it's finally over. Yeah, me too. What about the game? Ah, uh, yes, we still haven't declared a winner. Shiba. Seriously? Hmm. I must say, I was heated for our final showdown. And I can only speak for myself here. But I'm not fit to fight at this point. I'm all burnt out. You and me both. Technically speaking, you have beaten me once before. But there isn't much sizzle in a victory by default. Don't tell me you want to play another round. <laughs> In case you didn't hear me the first time, I'm all burnt out. Let's just call it a draw, this time. I hadn't given much thought to what to do in this situation, but I suppose that means it's game over. In other words, we're done here, everyone. Just like that? What are we supposed to do? Go home, back to the RG. Toss that pin and you're all set. You'll be home before you know it. Gotcha. What about you, Shoka? I'll let you rejoin our ranks, if you so desire. Huh? Why would she do that? Where else would she go if not back to Shinjuku with us? Back to the RG with us? She couldn't even if she wanted to. It's one of our rules back in Shinjuku. Once you're stripped of your title as a Reaper, you're out for good. So you wait. And when the game finally reaches its conclusion, you face Erasure. What? That's the rule. She knew what she was doing when she joined your team. Is that true? <sighs> If you wish to rejoin the Reapers, then I'll give you till the end of the day. The decision is yours. Damn. Sounds like you don't really have a choice here. Says who? Shiba, you heard him. Well, what if I don't want to go back? I'm sick of being a Reaper. So you just disappear? Pretty much. I've made my peace. What the hell? Why didn't you say something? Didn't know I was obligated to. Be happy. The game's over. 
You got what you wanted. No, I didn't. Huh? I wanted to play with you. Um... Van Gogh, we were gonna play! Since when? You're Swallow, aren't you? <gasps> you told me right before I turned back time. You've been there for me longer than I realized. I get that the game has to end. But our friendship doesn't have to. Well, you got me. Me and my big mouth. Me and my big mouth. Listen, Rindo. If I return to the Reapers, I'll be stuck playing that dumb game forever. And I won't be able to see you. Not in person, at least. And that would really suck. It's been fun. And I'm glad we got to talk like this. You make a pretty good partner. Ah, uh, parting is such sweet sorrow. Joshua! You fucking um, dipshit! Oh, no. <laughs> the name's <sighs> Yoshia Kiryu. But mother and father call me Joshua. I suppose you can call me Joshua too. Uh, can we help you? No, but perhaps I can help you. You may not know this, but I'm Shibuya's composer. Wait, the composer? So you write music no, or something? No, he's like the game master's master's master. What say we celebrate this chance encounter with a little game? What kind of game? Shoka! What did you do to her? I put her back on the street with the other stray cats. Find her, and you win. She could be anywhere. Good luck finding that anywhere, Rindo. What the fuck, Josh? Joshua, what the fuck is your problem? Every single time. Every single fucking time. All I'm saying is I totes deserve a long vacation after this. I mean, I risk like a literal frick ton of noise. You're not the only one who busted their ass out there. Could have earned a nice promotion for myself if I'd kept track of all the points I racked up. <laughs> Even you hold your weight out there, math man. Gotta say, I'm looking forward to having you back on the team. Huh, don't try to integrate me with you garbage reapers. Excuse you? Who are you calling garbage, you overgrown adolescent? I'm trying to solve a bigger system of equations here. Those Shinjuku Reapers didn't factor into my calculations, but they did help reveal a hidden variable. The composer. <laughs> Time to run some figures. Is that number cruncher really trying to become the next composer? If so, he should work on his delivery. Less math, for starters. Eh, best to just let him do his thing, girl. Actually, I'd high-key prefer if he, like, didn't do his own thing. He should, like, listen to his master. Huh, since when did he have a master? Um, since I ever so graciously brought him back to life? Which means he owes me a super de duper big favor or two. And I'm totes gonna make sure he pays me back. Or he'll face super de duper big consequences. <laughs> Good luck to her. She'll need it. There's no way he's taking orders from anyone. <sighs> but enough chit chat. It's time to get back to work. You really went above and beyond, girl. If I didn't know any better, I would have thought you really did have a promotion on the line. <sighs> if only. 
all that hard work and nothing to show for it but utter exhaustion. I think it's time I took a vacation. How's about a bowl of ramen to kick things off? Your treat? My pleasure. Then count me in. Slurping noodles by myself was getting pretty boring anyway. <laughs> I know the feeling. Nice work, Neku. I knew I could count on you. Count on me to break free, you mean? After you locked me up? <laughs> I saved you. You're welcome, by the way. <laughs> After you locked me up? Reaper. So, when she shot you, I sent you to Shinjuku as a precautionary measure. I appreciate your concern. But I think we both know you had an ulterior motive. <laughs> Well, aren't you the super sleuth? I'll admit, I wanted to make sure you kept my secrets to yourself. Didn't give me much choice. My sincerest apologies. I should have known I could trust you, dear partner. Dear partner. Oh, brother. Although, I did worry dealing with the executor might have been too tall an order. You mean that Kubo guy? Indeed. I had got to intervene if things took a turn for the worse. But you all seem to handle things on your own just fine. Hey, Josh. Yes? Can I go home now? To the RG? You mean you don't have your sights set on staying here and becoming composer? Can't say that I do. <laughs> your loss. Your loss. Very well, then. One good turn deserves another, as they say. Let's not keep her waiting any longer. Your social network has been updated, Yoshua, Joshua Kiryu. Wait, Shiba, where are you going? Sugumi. The Shibuya Reapers said they'd let us stay. Aren't you going to take them up on their offer? No, I'm going back. But why? Because it burns me up getting played like that. I can't let that be my legacy. It's my fault Shinjuku's in ruins. I ought to be the one who starts rebuilding it. <sighs> I chose to bring about Shinjuku's destruction. It's only fair that I then take responsibility for the decision I made. And to that end, I suppose I also owe a few folks an apology. In that case, is it alright if I go with you? What? Don't you prefer it here? I admit it isn't bad, but there's no place like home, right? And if you're going to restore things to the way they were, then I want to help. You're too kind. Allow me to join you. No one knows quite how to snuff out my flame like you, old friend. Care to stomp on my embers too while you're at it? And sully the soles of my shoes? I think not. You've chosen to run from the city you once ruled. I needn't embarrass you further. That said, if you seek to restore Shinjuku to its former glory, then I cannot stand idly by. Nor can I. I've got data on Shinjuku. Th that should help us start rebooting the city. Well, I suppose I could use the company. A simple word of thanks would have sufficed. You'll get your thanks once you've earned it. <laughs> thanks for everything, Shibuya. See you again someday. Yo, Ryan. Why you ain't gone home yet? Come on, let me live a little beat. I'll study and no play makes when I'm an overworked girl. Not to mention how worried I was when you disappeared. I spent all my waking hours trying to find you. And all my not waking hours asleep at my PC. Don't you think I deserve to take a load off for once? I don't see no load around here. But you right. Gotta have some fun once in a while, yo. Hey, beat. Sup, Shiki? Any luck? Not yet. I don't think he's back yet. Don't sweat. Bones is a man of his word, yo. He'll be back in no time. And if he ain't, then I'ma give Brisk Kid a piece of my mind. Josh better watch out. I'm sure Neku's fine. But yeah, Neku's a man of his word, but Josh ain't Just fucking dumbass. Yeah, I feel you. But hey, you'll know him when you see him, huh? Hey there. Hello. Sure is some lovely weather we're having, isn't it? It sure is. <laughs> Hate to spend such a nice day all by myself. Skew 
Excuse me a sec, yo. Uh, okay, but don't start any trouble. <laughs> don't start any trouble. <sighs> any minute now, right? He should be able to spot me thanks to this little guy. Every morning I tell myself, today will be the day, but I'm always wrong. Not today. Huh? Right. <sighs> right. Neku! Neku! Hey. Hey. Sorry it took me so long. Sorry it took me so long. You know. It's okay. I just had to take a giant dub. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All that matters is that you're here now. Thanks. I'm so happy you're back, Neku. Yay! Puberty hit him like a train. Shiki Misaki. Ah, <sighs> feels pretty good. You know what I mean? And you know what I mean? Right. Man, I miss this. The hustle and bustle of the city. It's good to be back. Yeah. Dude, I started playing Alestra. That game Nagi's obsessed with? Yep. There's this guy, the one who looks like Mr. Minami. He keeps smiling at me. <laughs> Lucky you. <laughs> but like, I kind of want to see where it goes, you know? You sound invested. The fuck, you already I just had to take a dump, really? Sorry. Elestra is more than a mere game. Tis a veritable tome of truths about the nature of human communication. One that teaches us serenity in the face of an overzealous opponent. Sorry, Lizzie. Perseverance in the face of an onslaught of abandonment. I guess she thinks it'll help make me a better communicator. Let's hope. Well, I'm stuffed. Catch you tomorrow? Sounds good. Hmm? Hey, there's a cactuar on the crossing. Guess I'd better go catch it before it runs off. <laughs> Gets hit by a car. And got him. I would message you. But you've been offline for over a month. And I haven't seen you since that guy made you disappear. I haven't even heard from you. The game's been over for weeks now. And the only trace left of you is this old account. You don't even show up in my contacts anymore. I just want to talk like we used to. But there's no way to reach you. There's so much I wanted to say. And now I'll never get the chance to tell you any of it. There she is. Uh, oh. Oh, oh. oh, sorry. No, it's okay. Rindo? It's you, right? Shoka? <gasps> Whoa, careful! <sighs> Still adjusting to life on the other side. Normally, I'd just pass right through people. You're here, in the RG. Mm, in the flesh, which is, you know, another new adjustment. Guess I'm a bit of a slow learner. The hell? You should have said something, I could have helped. Yeah, you could have helped by not ignoring my friend requests. Huh? I got locked out of my accounts, including my alt, and I made a new one so we could be friends. But somebody didn't check his inbox. No way. No, oh, my bad. Can't go too. Seriously? Oh shit. Hmm. Unfortunately, I'm back at level one. 
so lend me a hand, okay? Uh, what? Uh, no, it's nothing. Mm -hmm. Pouty face. Got a nutkin I can give you. Oh, sweet. Sweet. Guess it's official now, Renda. What? We're finally friends. <clears throat> so cute. That's it. It's done. It's over. <gasps> now we've got eight days until Pokemon Legends Arceus arrives. Such a fucking... friends with benefits <laughs> okay little talk uh i'm not good at little talks <laughs> Okay, so the world that the world ends with you, the first game, came out on the DS like way way back. I don't know the original year, but I played that. Uh, I was still young, and we had those R4 cards for the DS, so I was like able to download and put it on my game and play it. Probably one of my favorite DS games back then. Then, last year, I think last year, two years ago, they re-released it for the Switch. Loved it. And, oh boy, did they deliver with Neo, like, as a sequel to The World Ends With You. Awesome. It's exactly what I remember from, like, the Switch version. Or, well, not exactly. Like, gameplay is completely different, everything. But, like, just the type of game that it was. With the dialogue, with the... Uh, story progression. Pins, leveling things up, finding things, doing things. <clears throat> it was, for me, this game was, like, really amazing, and hearing, even though I, like, took a long time before I actually started playing the game after it released last year, around July, it saddens me to hear that people have been sleeping on this game franchise at all. If you like Final Fantasy, if you like Kingdom Hearts, if you are a fan of anything Square Enix, I would recommend this game 100%. Just go play it. And uh, play it on your own pace, on your own time, on your own whatever. I decided to play this game on a hard difficulty, which made it uh, decently challenging. It was not necessarily that hard. There were moments where I was like, okay, I need to take the right path and do this specifically in a certain way, otherwise I would get my ass kicked, but it was never that hard. The game is fun to grind, there are so many options, you can like build your team the way you want it to. It's just insanely fun, and that's it. That's all I can say. I had a good time with this game, and I'm glad it's done, sort of. 
because I really want to play more Yu-Gi-Oh, but <laughs> Jesus Christ. I've been dreaming this game for like days now already since I started playing and it's insane. <laughs> the world begins with you. That is fucking GG. They did. I only have it on the DS. Uh, yeah, they brought it out for the Switch as well. Well, I just realized that we only had Neku for two days in the game. Super funny. Okay, let me go have a save here. Overwrite the save file. Previous data will not be reloaded. Complete. Yep. Oh. Neku. It does bring you back to the title screen, that's good. Okay. Yeah, so, um... I don't know, amazing game, loved it. Like, I was really curious to the progress and how it was gonna end. That ending was completely unexpected. Honestly, the fact that Kubo gave the powers to both Shiba and to uh, Rindo, and that Rindo was the backup, all his time traveling actually a little also sh ensured Shinjuku's destruction. That was kind of dope. The fact that that uh, does gas that other character appeared, random angel out of nowhere. And then Joshua at the end also appears like, Oh, let me help you out there, buddy! Ah. <laughs> same, same with at the end, just popping Shoko and like Rindo be like, Nani? Yeah, I... They did, they did the fans of the original game a lot of justice, and I really enjoyed it. Obviously, this is the end of the playthrough for me. Like, this is all I'm gonna post on YouTube. This is all that I'm gonna, like, be streaming. I will be tackling this game on my own time when I am in the mood. Because I have MapleStory to play. I have now Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duels to play as well. And more games. I am planning on tackling this game a bit more. Like, seeing grinding and doing some other things. I don't know when or how or what. And what the planning is it with it. I'm kind of curious to see if I can actually, like, platinum it. I could probably platinum this game if I put in the time and effort. But for now, it's kind of on the... So, yeah. Thank you guys all very much for hanging out with me tonight. I hope you all had a fantastic time. It's 3 a.m. I should go to bed and uh, talk to you all tomorrow's a good night.